And away we go. Hooray, hurrah for today's stream. Starting a little early today because I actually got up at a reasonable hour and I'm like, you know what? I'm just sitting around here twiddling my thumbs. I might as well just go ahead and start. Maybe you can go a little longer today. I don't know. Let's find out. It's all exciting here. Oh, that chat's too big. Okay. Still doing our uh, our setup here. Get our command center all in, uh, in position. And, uh, hmm, that's still too big. La dee da dee dee. Okay, that'll work. That should be fine. Go back over here. Oh boy. Alright. Green lights flickering to orange and yellow. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but hopefully it will stay the same and check. Okay. Alright, let's back up here. Get situated in the comfort zone. Nick Dalton. I'm still early. <laughs> Sorry, man. Well, the good thing is this will be back on the replay. Jason, what's up? Welcome to the stream, guys. How are you guys doing today? Yeah, start a little early today. I'm just like, you know what? I, I got up at a reasonable hour, and I'm like, I'm just sitting here doing nothing. I might as well just go ahead and start. Maybe I can go a little more than three hours today. I don't know. But I don't know if we going to even need it because uh, I don't know. Sujama and RP Jax, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Um... Okay, so today's plan, of course, is to uh, probably start working on this area right out here in the front, in El Frente. Um, can't really do much with that, right? That thing's outside the build border, right? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, oh no, it isn't. Look at this. Look at this cheesy shit. Um, okay. Okay, so this gate... Uh, is it going to light up? Why isn't it lighting up? This is strange. Okay, so the gate does not include the pole. It's this fence that has the pole. So if I pull this down... Okay, so it does have the pole on the other side. So if I do pull the gate down, I have to pull both of them down. But I can keep that chain link over there. <laughs> Sound like I sorted the back. Yeah, it's uh, the, the allergies were... Uh, they hit hard, but they go away in about, uh, I don't know, four days or so. I mean, I feel like death for those four days. I thought I was getting the flu for sure, but nope. So yeah, I, I'm uh, I'm back to uh, quote unquote normal, <laughs> I guess you could say. And uh, who the hell are you, dude? Oh, it's Roger, looking like a normal settler. I was like, what the frick, dude? Okay. So I guess what we can do is uh, look around and see if I can get the creative juices flowing. Such as it is, he seems puzzled by his inability to get in there. He walks around it and then can't get in the front. It's like, Roger, dude. Denise, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Headed to work? All right, cool. Good to see you. Hopefully you can uh, stop by a little bit later as I eyeball this shit and try and figure out what it is I will be doing. Um, hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Okay. So this part is, yeah, I guess the foyer here is pretty much done. Mikey, how you doing, Smoke? Welcome to the stream, dude. Just uh, coming through here. Silver Fox, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Just walking through here, trying to refresh my memory on this place, because I've been uh, I've been building with the FNG as of late, and I've hit a stumbling block. I can't figure out what I want to do with the yellow house. Although yesterday, I did have an idea and so far it's coming out kind of okay Ian how you doing welcome to the stream and happy birthday Ian happy birthday welcome to the stream and you love my bills well thanks man I hope you uh, I hope you steal a lot of shit but I'll give some ideas man and uh makes your game more fun Rhonda how's it going welcome to the stream um so yeah this thing here uh we need something here yeah what does he need in here? There's nothing up top, right? Um, uh, maybe just give him a desk. I mean, you can just stick a desk right there, or right here. Um, hmm. There's this little blue desk, right? Do we have the blue desks in this one? No, the blue desks are mods. <laughs> professional thief of my decision. Well, there you go, man. That's what they're for, dude. Steal away. Steal as much as you like, as often as you like, and go crazy. Because that's what they are friggin' for. Uh, 
Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that one maybe. And then, oh my god. Can we come out of here? Wow, it. Okay, so. Let's have to move it over this way a little bit more. Yeah. Blue desk is in tables. Oh, it's not a container? Oh. Oh, okay. Well then, shit. Uh, it's in tables, huh? Alright. Because that makes perfect sense. There, there should be desks in both categories, right? Because they're both desks. Oh, there it is. Oh, these are the little snappy ones, huh? Ah, yeah. We'll give him a little snappy one here. Lady X, how's it going to the stream? It isn't 12. Yeah, I actually got up at a reasonable hour today. So <laughs> I was sitting around here waiting for 12 o'clock to come by. I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to go. I'm just going to start. It's like, why not? What? Why you got to be like this, man? Okay, let's see if I can get it out to go out here. Um, all this work to put a goddamn desk in here, man. Dun, 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 dun. Is the hotspot there? Okay, now you're starting to piss me off, dude. Um, let's go outside and elevate it. As I try to figure out... Oh, look, it's raining again. Joy. Joy. Okay. So, yeah, today's plan is to... Um, to oh, I'm an idiot. Hi. Duh, it snaps. Duh, hey, duh. Of course it does in rug. It snaps. Die, die. You can't take me anywhere, folks. Did you just call it snappy? Yeah, I, I'm slow, but I get there, RP. Easy, Eric. How you doing? Welcome to the stream, sir. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm fumbling about with stuff I already know and forgotten, and yeah, I just. Tell you what, man, streaming building keeps you humble, man, because you're like, because when you fuck up, it's live, and people are like, uh, dude, you're a moron, and I'm like, yeah, I, I know, I mean, thanks, but I, I know, and, uh, yeah, so, um, hmm, not really feeling that, hmm, you completed Builder on Dread Mode? Nice! Yeah, Builder's one of the easier ones, because all you got to do is just hold out, you know? And if you don't care about your uh, your other survivors, it uh, it goes pretty straightforward. Trader! Trader, Lady X. That is one that will test your patience. I try to see how soft this place was in my game. It isn't just STS. Yeah, if, if, as, if any mods that turn these into scrappable things, any scrap mod modifies your... Uh, is going to change the physics. That's just how they do. Uh, most of the time it changes it for the better, so it's definitely worth using them, but you, it doesn't have the same, it won't have the same, um, it won't have the same abilities as straight vanilla. Just the nature of the beast. It's a trade-off, you know, you, you get, you get, you know, you get amazing amounts of, um, the ability to, uh, get away with stuff. But, on the downside, you lose some of the functionality that the glitches that we've come to depend on also themselves depend on. So, um, Fergie, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. It's Sunday! How's it going? How you doing? Uh, yeah, I like that. No. Like this. Right. And then this... Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. All this work just to get a goddamn desk and a chair in there, man. Just the struggle is real. The struggle is real. Winterbeard, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. And Kelly, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Okay. Let's get this stupid desk in there. Let's see if I can't get this dumb desk in there. And then we'll. Uh, I always like to do the little fiddly things to warm up, I guess, to stretch my building legs, as it were. Yeah, that's a little bit better. Man, that rug doesn't want to go anywhere near... Okay, look at this. The rug doesn't want to touch this concrete on the left. It just doesn't want to cooperate there. Um, What's well, a rug? I can just put it there and just look at it. Uh, okay, the desk has to move a little over to the left. So let's move the desk a little over to the left. That's one of the bad things about building inside like this. But you've got to go way the hell in and out to get anything done. Because you've got no room to work inside the place. 
Ah, <sighs> okay. All right. So today's overall plan is to add a marketplace of sorts in the front, and uh, I will be I will be actively stealing Clinton's uh, Clinton's uh, marketplace and his roadside eatery model form factor because I saw that I'm like oh my god I love the hell out of this thing, and uh, the link to his tour is in the description so you can see what it is. Credit where it's due. Credit where it's due. Okay, and that's really dark back there, so I guess what we can do is add a light. Uh, where's that blue lamp? This one here, yeah. Of course, it's not lit up because there's no conduits back there, so what we're going to have to do then is take this opportunity to start wiring. So here comes the boring part, right? The boring part of wiring this place. Okay, so this thing is, again... The pole on the left and no pole on the right. So if I take this down, I'll have to take that down. Or, um, Sandy, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Um, Yulia, how you going? Welcome to the stream. So let's go ahead and get this wired. And, uh, probably going to use that at some point. So let me just store it. And then the other one is up on top, so we need to go grab that bad boy. And warehouse stairs. And JPEG, if you are watching this later, dude, the reason I use these ladders instead of the wood ladders is so they have railings so I don't fall off the sides. <laughs> from, from watching your stream the other night, I'm like, dude, use the ring, but I couldn't say anything because I was like trying to figure out what the hell it is you were even doing. I couldn't, uh, couldn't process most of that shit. Barbarian King, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Okay. So now what we need to do is I want to build I want to build a little guard station thing up here, but I want to build something in here as well. Uh, okay, so this is where it gets complicated, right? Because I want to do like two or three different things at once, and I'm not sure how the whole thing's going to turn out. So I'm like, okay, build order, build order, build order. What has to go in first? Because as you know, I don't really like building from the top down because I run out of room at the bottom or I have some kind of weird space at the bottom and I can't figure out how to get it up there. And uh, so we have to go bottom up, right? And I want to build a little storage area for this crap down here. So what I can do is I can use a prefab. Yeah. I can use... You know what? Let's use a metal prefab. Let's use this thing here, right? Because that, like, that looks like a decent... Uh, that looks like a decent um, storage, coverage, container, dealy bobber. So I can get this thing on the bottom. I get myself a roof. I can get myself a roof snapping edge that I can use to snap the, the floor thing to it. And then, um, yeah, see, I can just do this, right? And that way I can get other floors up on top of it. God, this is fucking stupid, though. I mean, look at this shit. So if I do this, right? Got to do it straight, right? Make sure it's straight. So I'm looking at the girder strip on the bottom, on the underside of the roof, to make sure it goes through the wall straight, right? It's okay. It's right about there, right? So now we got this little, this little, um, and it's just started raining again immediately. Yeah, fuck you, Warwick. Piece of shit. All right. Hey, Lena, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Um. Uh, ba 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 ba. So. Now I need to build up to the top, so let's start doing that. Okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to grab ourselves the wood floor with the, with the snapping edge. Booyah! And now I can do some shenanigans up on the top. Yay hooray! Yay hooray! Okay, so we got this. Yeah. Now, uh, I'll have to snap a... No, a floor. I can snap floors. Let's can I snap... Huh, you know, I should probably just do this, yeah? Look at that shit! Look at that! Oh, yeah! Um. Okay, so if I need a stairway... Okay, it's the... The scaffolding... Okay, guys, remind me. Scaffolding snaps... Well, how's the order go? You put the scaffolding floor down, then you put the regular floor in, take the scaffolding floor out, and put the regular floor in back. Right? 
Okay, this is too friggin' tall. So we're gonna use this one. Because this one should go here. And that way I can use what? I can use uh, just a regular floor piece. And uh, Ozfest, how you doing? Gregory, how you doing? Gregory? Or is it Gregory? Gregory. <laughs> We're Sullivan in the game. Yeah, I know. That's, well, people voted on this one, Gregory. So I'm like, I got to do this one, dude. This is what this is what the community demands. <laughs> so that's what I got to do. Okay, so now we're going to build down. We got to build down a little bit. See if this works. Okay. So you got that. We're going to get the... No, I don't need the fire. I don't think for this work here. I'm correcting your... Okay, perfect. Thanks, Mikey. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. So we're going to do this. No. No, we're going to do this. Let's grab this one. And go up to the top. And see what I can get away with over here. Because if I can go up from the bottom with this on the overhanging over the side... Ah, it looks like shit, though. Um... Okay, so how am I going to do this? we got to do it like this. Yeah? Okay. We're just going to go for... We're just going to go for blunt force trauma placement here. Right? Just going to stick it in there. And, uh... Get the scaffolding. <laughs> they put it on a select track. They like to make me work. That is absolutely the case. I am not even going to try to deny that part of our of our thing there. So if we do that, um, how do I want to do this? I want to go warehouse floors, right? So let's get one of that little. Let's get that little mesh piece, right? And then, uh, blah, 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 uh, scaffolding ladder. Yeah? Where's that little thin no rail one? This one here. Will you snap through the floor? You will not snap through the floor. Fascinating. But, if I do this instead. Come on, come on. Try to feel a little shit. Come on. So, if I put you there. A little bit more. Okay, so it turns red there. I gotta say, using a controller on the PC is a little more precise than this, yeah? Uh, In-game sound effects a little too high. Uh, I haven't changed the settings, Ozfest, so it may be just you. I, I don't have a way to tell. Um, shit, well. Well, is it gonna snap to this? Can I get it to snap to this? It'll snap through the wall. Okay. Um. Are you kidding? Come on. Ah, ah, ah. Where the hell is it? Come on. You were just... You were just there. I saw it, and then I lost it. Okay, maybe I gotta go from the top. God, these things are so goddamn finicky. Ugh. Ugh. Come on, baby. You can do this. Yeah, it snaps to the wall. You know what? I'm gonna put it there and see what it looks like inside. Just for the shits and giggles. It's not there. Huh, can't see it at all. Okay, well, hmm. Well, hmm, he said, hmm, mealy. Damn it, I hate when I see it snap and then I just lose it. When I'm moving around and it snaps, I'm like, ah! And then it just goes away. Come on. Okay, so if I move, like two inches the other way it works fine I fucking sure whatever whatever that's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine it's fine build a set of true flat stairs yeah I could I mean I got the fire and I could totally do it on top of this roof because it's only one one section here um I'm uh, voting the vault <laughs> my mental stability to be challenged to be challenged yeah, I guess. That implies that I have some to begin with, though, Dalton. That's a, that's a pretty that's a pretty big ask, as they say. 
Yeah, let's do that. And then uh, pull this one out. Can you snap together on the ground and move up there in one piece? Maybe, but the difficulty with that is it often does not want to cooperate. So this will suffice. I mean, this is this gets me up there, yeah. And I don't really need anything else here. I can just snap a scaffolding railing and call it good, which is what I probably should do. So let's just do that. And of course, the scaffolding railing doesn't want to snap here because why would it? But if I go down here, maybe it will. Um, come on, baby. In you go. No. No. Hmm, interesting. Jim, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. The wall is incredible. Yeah, it is. I'm, it, I, am, I am learning that it is a lot thicker than I was uh, anticipating. Okay, so we're going to scrap that, and then we're going to put... You know, I'll put a scaffolding railing there. Take this off. Put a scaffolding railing there. And then... Uh, just snap another... Uh, Snap another. Well, not snap, but put another railing right here. Oh, you gonna be like that, huh? Okay, fine. I will group select you into place. You little shit. BK, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, dude, that's, you're going to get lots of those today, man, because it's going to be a, uh, oh, shit. It's going to be a, a, mu a much thinking and, and pondering out loud and the whatnots. Dun, dun, dun. Sandy misses Jim. Is he away on business? Is he traveling or something? Or is it, uh, or are you just goofing? He's like, oh, I miss you. It's been 10 minutes and you're downstairs. Oh, my God, darling. <laughs> You're just gooping and shit. Okay, so see, look at that. Groups like will solve a lot of problems. Yeah, baby. Yeah. That'll work. Sure. Okay. Oh, I didn't mean to store the thing. Ah, wow, wow. Get that thing back out. Yada, yada, yada. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, so now I don't need this thing at all anymore, do I? No, sir, I do not. Dun, dun, dun. John, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Okay. All right. The TWSS jokes like they write themselves. Yeah, they used to... BK, I don't know if you were here in the earlier days, but they used to keep count. There was just a running total of how many times I said shit like that. And uh, it got to the point where Groucho was like, yeah, I'm not going to keep track anymore, dude. This is fucking ridiculous. <laughs> we get like 20 and 30 a stream. JPIC, how's it going, baby? Welcome to the stream. Um... Yeah, I just need a wall for that side, so let's go ahead and get a wall for that side. You're away in Washington State. Oh, okay. Well, I hope you're having a good trip, and I hope everything's going well. Let me check the size on this thing. Maybe I can get a warehouse wall in there instead. Or a barn wall? Warehouse wall? You didn't scrap the post. Yeah, I've got so much concrete, I don't mind scrapping them. I just, I don't like misplacing them. Like, okay, where the fuck did I put it? I know I had one. And if I don't, if the count's wrong, I'm just like, I'd held it. Huh. If I do this, is that going to be wide enough? Yeah, it'll be wide enough. That's good enough. Good enough. And it's going to, nope, funeral. Ooh, I'm sorry. Sorry to hear that. I hope everyone's doing well, as well as can be expected in that sort of situation. Okay. Nixo, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? Oh, uh, Helena, I am still working on my uh, my entry into your challenge. I uh, hit a sort of weird, weird block the other... What? Okay. I hit sort of a weird block the other day, but I think I have... I think I've gotten past it. I'm not sure, and I can't see the top of this, which is not... I need to see the top more than you see the bottom. So let's go through here. So yeah, that little, that little sanctuary build on the FNG is still coming along. It's um, it's it's turning into an in. Wow, that's kind of nice. Okay, and sure. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, lady, uh, Helena's got a challenge for uh, like a small. A small 
settlement. A small settlement. Um, she's got mod. She can link it. If you don't mind linking it, Helena, that would be great. But it's open-ended. There's no time limit. So that's that suits me well because I'm having real difficulty with uh, getting it... Um, getting it done. And you're going to snap there. This would be a cool thing to... You know what? No, the other one. The other way. Yeah, let's do that one. <laughs> da -da -da -da. More info. More info on... What, Lady X? Sorry. I'd be happy to answer, but I'm sort of hopping around subject here. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know which one you're referring to. I don't know how long ago it was that I mentioned something. And as noted, I have the attention span of a goldfish, so memory of a goldfish. And Okay, so how is this going to go? Okay, this thing does not like that touching that metal thing at all. Okay, here. Wow, that looks pretty cool. So there. Okay, that's as good as it's going to get then, yeah? Yeah, that's fine. Who did the challenge? Oh, it's Helena. It's Helena's challenge. And there's the link with the rules. It's basically two shops, ten sellers, defense, food, water, self-supporting. That I recall. So, you can do that sort of thing. Oh, you ain't gonna snap for me, huh? You're gonna be like that. That's okay. We'll just leave it open. It's fine. It's fine. Julie, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Uh, <laughs> not true goldfish. Oh, man, you guys are already breaking my balls today. Then I see how it goes. Okay, I get it. <laughs> no, it linked. It's there. Uh, Helena, it's, if you're on top chat, you got to go to live chat on the chat window. But I can see it. It's there. Links don't post in top chat for some reason a lot of the time. Okay, so we got this little under storage place here. Yeah? Uh... God damn, it's dark here. I can't do this. What time is it? Oh, it's 5 o'clock. Okay. Let's go ahead and um, go ahead and rest, and hopefully we get some more rain in the daytime. Dun, 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 dun. We'll go for 12, 13, 14. Yeah, that'll be fine. Put the ad up. la dee dee da but Yeah, that sanctuary build I worked on with the FNG, what, about a week and a half ago? Hasn't really changed much since then. I'm just, I'm really having trouble figuring out what to do with the inside of the house. But I got an idea the other day when I was farting around with, uh, farting around with, um, farting around with Brotherhood Radiance. And I'm like, oh, maybe I should do that. So, so I farted around with it, built a little bit on the inside, and it's coming, uh, FNG, it, a fucking new guy. <laughs> Rob, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> He's a fucking new guy. <laughs> That's what FNG is. Um, so, yeah. He's... What's up, dude? Okay, sure. Um, dun, 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 dun. Alright, so that's there. Okay, so now we need to build up on top, yeah? We need to put something up here. But the good thing is, I don't need to put anything else up here because I've got that. And we're going to put something up over the doors. I can put this away because... Okay, so we're going to go... Now it's time to do another one of those magic structures I'd like to do, which is basically build the entire goddamn thing over here and then just drop it on top. So we're going to go... We're going to build a, a standard guard tower because I like... You know... You know, get no antibiotics. Yeah, it's, dude, you just got to get lucky. Hit, like I said, in like in Settlements of Survival, hit that bus that's over there by uh, by Concord, the one over there by the by the little settler camp. That little med kit responds very, very frequently. You can get lucky there sometimes. <laughs> I wonder. Um, okay, I got to turn the light on. This is stupid. I, I can't get it to stop raining, so we're just going to have to suffer through the rain. I would feel bad, but y'all picked this, so I don't care. Okay. 
I've never actually done this before. This would be a pretty good guard post, right? Pretty good, pretty good guard thing. Especially if we turned it around backwards, yeah? We turn around backwards and push this in. Well, it doesn't really push in there. But if I slid it through there with a rug. Ogre, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Um. Let's see here. Okay. Let's do this. Let me see how this looks before I get before I get married to it. Go. There you go. Da -da -da -da. So if I do it like this, and I do it with the backwards in out, right? If I do it like this and just drop this right through here. That actually looks kind of cool. Never really tried to do it like this before. That's what she said. Well, that would be effective if it was facing forward, dipshit. <laughs> Put the side of it through there. Herpeter to herpeter. But why? It seems awfully narrow. I was like, well, yeah, no shit, dude. You got it in there sideways. Duh. Duh. Okay, so we're going to put it down a little bit. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. And the guard will be looking like there. Now the trick is, will this thing drop when I take out the rug? Probably not, right? Because the guard posts don't always drop. Yeah. Okay, so there's that, yeah? And, uh, still interesting that Snapple Peace guy. I know, right? Well, you know what I think part of it is, too, JPEG? Is that other things snap to it, but it doesn't snap to anything itself. I don't know if that makes any damn difference, but it's the only piece I know, other than the trailer, where things only snap to it, it doesn't snap to other things, if that makes any damn sense at all. And this is probably not going to work because my snap point is backwards. My snap point is backwards. So I don't know if this is even going to work because all my snappable edges are on this half of the frame. So I may need to put it around the other way. Yeah, I gotta put it around the other way. Gotta put it around the other way. If it'll place. Okay. Let's do this again. Second verse, same as the first. La -de 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 -da. I hope y'all can see this okay. I mean, it's it seems pretty well lit. I mean, because I'm not really looking at things far away. And, uh... But it's... I guess it's just gonna rain all day today, so we're gonna have to deal with that. Groucho, welcome to the stream. Happy Sunday, sir. How you doing? Okay. We're going to have to do it this way, unfortunately. Because I need the snapping edge on the inside. And down we go. And in. Push it out a little bit. Yeah. See, that looks pretty goddamn formidable like that. And then down a smidgen. Sure. Okay. Lift it, drop it, take it out. And it drops. Which is not terrible. I can do. I'm feeling better. Yeah, Groucho. It's it's allergies, man. They come and go. I just feel like warmed over to death for like four days, five days, whatever. And uh, okay, I can't group select this. What? Okay, I can group select it on the frame, but I can't group select it on the guard shack. Look at this. I hold it, and nothing happens. Interessante. Never moved to Seattle. Yeah, no worries about that, Fergie. I don't do cold, I don't do rain, and I don't do overcast. If I don't get 200 days of sun a year, I start to, uh, I start cracking skulls. I just, I can't handle that. I, I need, I need, um, okay, so what? What's going to happen from here? I mean, I've got that. Okay, good, fine. But what's going to go on the sides? Can I snap? These things there, these little sidewalls don't snap to the door frame, do they? Okay, look, here's Roger. Okay, let's see what he looks like. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's that's pretty cool. I can deal with that. Um, Adam, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Um, 
so what can I do with this and how is it going to work Okay, resolved. I've got to put the I got to put the guard station in last. Yeah. Got to turn the corner. We'll need a floor roof for snapping. Yeah, it's. I, I'm gonna have to take that guard station back out, right? Yeah. I'm gonna take that back out. So we're gonna leave you there for now, Roger. So now I know it'll fit in there. Uh, <laughs> I wonder, can I do, can I do, it will snap to the back of this. Huh, so if I do that, then this, Can go there. Well, that's an interesting form factor. Um, well, that shit's got potential. Slacker, how's it going, baby? Welcome to the stream. Um, we gotta go. All right, Gregory. Thanks for stopping by, man. Good to see you. Hope you had a good time. Good luck with the flat. That's weird. Uh... Hmm, well. So if I go up there, if I put that up there, that'll fit. I mean, that's that's not, that's not too, uh... Dag, how's it going, baby? Welcome to the stream. Uh, let's see, I got a floor in here, right? Well, I do now. So you've got that. So if I put, what, two more floors on the outside here, like here and here? Oop, don't do that. Come on. And that way maybe I can put a railing on the side? Can I put a railing on the side? Will this thing go? No. See, it snaps there to the left-hand side, but it won't snap to this because of the other thing. Um, hmm... <coughs> <laughs> what to do, what to do. So the guard station goes in the middle. I've got this here. I guess I could leave the floor there. It don't hurt nothing. Um, hmm. That railing... That would, that rail, that, blah, 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 this stupid wire fence is not wide enough, right? The double wide is too wide or not wide enough for this? Too wide. It's too wide. Okay. Um, this is one funky looking structure. Yeah, it's, it's something. I mean, I, like I said, I'm just kind of winging it right now, trying to figure out, I mean, because I know, uh, I know kind of what I want it to look like, sort of, yeah? But I don't know how to get there from here so what I do is I just throw things at it until something looks cool makes sense you know doesn't suck whatever and uh, oh and by the way speaking of which that's why my style is the way it is I just I throw things at, I throw things at the problems I'm like okay that, that doesn't suck and that way I, I have a lot more latitude in application and uh, JPEG I was gonna tell you the other night I was watching you do I was watching you fart around with uh, Quapa, you know, doing that stuff on your stream, and I realized why I don't use Place Anywhere and why I can't use Place Anywhere. Because it gives me too many options. I would have too many ways to solve problems. And I think that would just lead to analysis paralysis. I would just lock the fuck up. I'm like, I have too many ways to solve this problem and I don't know which one to pick. With vanilla, my options are limited. So my choices, my choices are few. So it's like, okay, I've only got a limited tool set to do this, and I can use them in combination, sure. But in the main, I can't do complicated, involved, you know, stuff like that, yeah? And playing around with it is a very time-intensive process, you know? It's very fiddly, it's very whatever. Now, for people like, you know, you who are you have creativity, 
it works great because it lets you do exactly what you want it to do. I never know what I want to do. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, this is... Ah, 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 I saw it, you little shit. Come here. There. That's what I wanted. Yes, like that. Okay. So now we've got that thing there, which is not terrible. So I think if I, if I were to try and use Place Anywhere, dude, I would just sit here playing with two pieces for three hours. I would just, it would, I would not get anything done. I would just be like, oh, I can do this, I can do that, I can fiddle this, I can fiddle that. Oh, I can move another two degrees this way. Blah. Yeah, no. And you'd be sitting there going, okay, he's been fucking with the same piece of plywood for an hour and a half. What is happening here? It's like, yeah, no. <laughs> I just, that's not, that's not something I can, okay, I can't move to the other side so I can see the pose. So that's, I, that's, that's what, that's the, that's what gives me uh, discomfort when it comes to place anywhere. It's just, I, I would just, I would, I would, I would literally endlessly fiddle with one goddamn piece. And at the end of the day, it wouldn't make any damn difference because nobody would notice that piece, but I would know it was there. You know, it's one of those things. I'm down like this. Okay, so up. That's about, about there. Yeah, something like that. That looks about right, yeah? Yeah. Is that the same height? Yeah, it's close enough. Okay, cool. Okay, so now we got that. So now we got that. Uh, sorry, you spent an hour now. Exactly, Adam. I mean, even now, these tools I spend too long. But see, this is coming together. This is coming together. Yeah? Um, I think you're selling myself short one time where they can do the choices are easier. I, yeah. I mean, technically, maybe, JPEG. I just, like I said, I don't think that way. I've been thinking in vanilla terms for so goddamn long. That it would just be strange to me to have to. Um, it would be very strange to um, have that much, have that many options. Yeah. It would just drive me bonkers. I'd be all. Bleh. Come on. Go on the back. You go here. Okay. So there's that. We've got that funky ass thing going. And if I put. This one over here, sure. And then this one over here. It just the thing about it, I think, is the the sticking point is that it it takes a focused effort to it takes a focused effort. What the hell am I doing with this? Now, well, let's quick save. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, let's get a rod. Let's get this out here. Yeah. Since the whole top of the roof is soft, I don't really give a crap. I can just sink this thing through anywhere. It doesn't really matter. Just drop this thing right through the middle there. Yeah. And uh, do that. And then we will get this ladder here. Um, I guess I should put it over here so I can see better, right? Yeah. Like right there. Sure, Roger. I'll just go over the top. Oh my god, the sun's coming out. What is even happening here? What is even happening here? Dun, dun, dun. Okay, that's good. I can see pretty good there. Alright. Let's quick save again to make sure we got this going here. It's, um... Okay. So here's our gigantic... Well, I gotta put the guard station in, don't I? <laughs> I guess I can do that later. <laughs> I'll do that later. Okay, so how much do we have here? Oh, yeah. Okay, so it's not liking something back there, but I don't know what. That's fine. There it is. Okay, so it has to go there. I can't tell if it's straight. Uh, put another ladder up here. Yeah, there we go. Now I can see. Okay. All right. Here we go. That's impossible. There's no sun at work. We're seeing it. We're seeing it, RP. It's it's happening. It's happening. <laughs> okay, and down you go. This entire gigantic block of a friggin' building goes right down on top. And put it in here. You can kind of see where the floor is going through there, so that's good. Pull it out a little bit more. Yeah right over the entrance 
and up. Oh, you don't like touching that railing and the bur that berm in the front, do you? Ooh, what's happening here? Why is it not working? Um, maybe the uh, maybe the pillar's too low. <laughs> There's so many moving parts here. I can't tell what's uh, what's even uh, what it could be possibly hanging up on. Come on. Okay, now we're just going to put you barely inside there. Yeah? Yeah, just barely underneath the floor. Whoops, don't do that. Maybe that'll help. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that front wall... It, well, see, the thing is, last week, or the week before, I don't remember, when we were testing it, things would snap right through that little berm in the front. But I got a feeling it's because I got this gigantic monstrosity here with varying elevations on the bottom. Yeah, see, now it's working. So it was the pillar. It was absolutely the pillar. It was the height of the pillar inside. So there we go. Problem solved. It was hitting something underneath. Maybe it was hitting the uh, it was hitting the door frame in there that I put in there. Okay, so that looks pretty straight here. We'll put up, put back a little bit. No, I want it there. Ah, uh, come on, and up. Okay, there's the bottom of the door frame. So right about there. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. But yeah, it might have been hitting this fan. It might have been hitting this this doorway. Oh, it was definitely hitting the doorway. See, there it is right there. <laughs> so it was it was hitting the doorway. It was hitting my inside doorway. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. So what's it look like? When it starts friggin' raining again. How the cellar gonna go up? We got a stairway on the side, Jason. Here, let me show you. Right here. I built a little a little storage compartment over all these barrels that I had here. And then just put scaffolding ladders up. This is the first thing I built, so they can get up this way. Okay, that's gotta go a little bit lower. Hopefully it does not Oh shit, it's gonna it's gonna pick up the whole settlement, isn't it? No? It's gotta go down just a little bit. Yeah, okay, there it is. So we got that, we got this, we got these. Jesus. This is really good, isn't it? <laughs> this is really good sight lines and shit up here, man. I'm telling you what. Okay, so we're gonna take this out. So this is this is the new guard station. Booyah. Now the tricky part is I have to be able to sink that uh I have to be able to sink that uh, that guard post in here, but it should be okay. Easy to run out the door there. Okay, let's go ahead and get that rug back out. How did that not grab the door? Um, maybe the. Well, here, watch. Let me show you. Take the concrete pillar, raise this thing all the way up, right? Okay, there's the rug, right? You see the rug? The concrete pillar does not like to grab top and bottom. It'll grab there, but it won't grab here. It grabs there. A little bit lower. But the top and bottom do not have right there. So that's what, about a, a six inch gap, three inch gap. So in the top and bottom, the collision, the grab plane on the current, the pillar is really small. Simo, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. You came with the background noise while you now. <laughs> it's funny you should say that, Simo. Because <laughs> we were talking to Discord, and John's like, I'm like, okay, get ready to stream. John's like, I'll just get ready to take a nap. I'm like, don't worry, dude. My stream is uh, notorious for putting people to fucking sleep. <laughs> and he's like, I know. <laughs> I'm like, yep. And then you come in today and say the same damn thing. <laughs> nice. Um, so, yeah, the concrete pillar doesn't even like to grab from top and bottom. So that's why I got a feeling it, it, did, it played nice with the... Uh, it played nice with the... Roger, where the fuck are you going? Oh, son, you are in for a disappointment. <laughs> That's what you're banking on. See? So, today is nap time. It's nap time for everyone today. Actually, you know what? Let's go up on that ladder. 
and uh, place it place it like we have a brain. Let's do that. Let's do that. Of course, now the roof's going to be in the way, so let's get rid of the roof. Okay. That's what you're banking on. <laughs> well, I'm glad my streams can provide a service. That's what we're here for. Um, okay. Back you up, look down, and out the door. Where's the posts? There they are. Center them up, and a little bit forward. Yeah. Okay. That'll work. That'll work. Nikita, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to Sleepy Stream 101, where everyone's going to be having this on in the background while they nap. Oh, look at that shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, let's get that. Let's get that. Uh, let's get that. Um. Well, you know what? No, I need to do this first. I need to put these poles in here. Um, where's my pole? Now, this is one thing I've never, I don't, I never really thought to try. I don't know if these will snap through. I don't know if the metal, the metal. Man, why you gotta be like this, man? It should go right there, though. It should go right there. Is this one going to work? Maybe this one will work. As we look into a hazy sky. Hooray, Warwick. Okay, there it was. I saw a green flash. Right. God, Jesus, this is finicky shit. Okay, you go there. Come here, you. Interesting, when you pull the stick down, it goes away. When you pull the stick forward, it goes back. Okay, it's hitting something under there. It's got to be hitting something under there. Uh, it goes there, though. It'll go there. What? But I need it on the inside. Of the you know, maybe it's just railing. Maybe it's the railing fault causing it to fuck up. No? Well, that ah, held it. That's good enough. That's close enough. Okay, now, will the metal roof go back on? Uh, let's find out. Usually, it plays nice, but it might not today because it's being a persnickety bitch. Okay, come on. Nope. Okay. So, we're going to need... You know what? I'm just gonna put a wall here to hold it. I'm just gonna put. Um... Well, you know what? I could probably just put. Let's see if this snaps. Yeah. Wouldn't it be a, wouldn't it be cool if it did, but it doesn't. It doesn't. The metal one might though. Um... Nah, the metal one's not gonna snap either. Wah, wah. Okay, that's fine. Um, hmm, Skullcrawler, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. All right, let's go ahead and just grab um, let's grab that weird this wall here. Yeah, yeah. Let's just do that. That'll be good. And I can put that metal roof back on. No, I want the roof. Thank you. Okay, so now. The inside of this looks like that, which is... Eh, it's interesting, I guess. It's interesting, I guess. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. It's fine. Don't overthink it, dude. That looks pretty goddamn formidable. Okay. Works. Works the barn floors? Yeah, the barn floors definitely are, but I wanted a I wanted a wall piece and overhang there so I could put like a little storage cubby, but it wasn't gonna work, so. Roger, I swear to god, I'm gonna murder you, dude. The institute's dead. You are no longer essential. Um Hmm. 
All right, Nixo, sorry about your stream. Sorry, connection. Hopefully, the replay won't be too boring. And, okay, so now that I've got that, I can fall off the roof a couple of ways now. That's pretty cool. That's pretty fucking sweet. Um, and I really want something here. Can I snap a concrete railing to that thing? Yeah, okay, good. You will snap. Good. Scaffolding won't put that well. Um, I don't like that, though. Okay, so here we go. What you do is I've got the scaffolding floor in there. When I've got the scaffolding floor in there, I can snap this thing to that, take this out, and then snap this. I just saw it. What did I do? It was down here, right? It was this angle down here that it snapped? I'll come back out of there. There it is. Okay. Perfect. That's what I needed. Yay, I remembered how to do it. <laughs> now it looks good. Yeah, now it snaps there. Kay, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. How's it going? You're pretty new to FF4 building, glad I caught a stream. Oh yeah, you are in the right place. If you want inspiration, ideas, tips, tricks, knowledge, man, shit, this is the place to be. Pretty much everybody with the blue name who's a moderator has their own channel with tons of bills and shit. You just, you have hit the mother load of resources here without a doubt. Welcome, 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 welcome. I hope you're enjoying the show and I hope that this is, uh, this is, uh, useful and entertaining tons of built well in the in the aggregate john if you're gonna if you're gonna be like that in the aggregate <laughs> oh my goodness oh my goodness you've already learned a lot from the stream alone okay cool I, okay if you have any questions if you, if you have any questions about what you're seeing or how something was done i am happy to stop and go over it really quick to show you how it works because, I mean, I use the same techniques over and over anyways. And um, there's really no... M really? You're going to be like that? Okay. So there's really no mysteries here. I mean, it's like I said, this is vanilla. That's This is why I build a vanilla. Because everybody can do everything you see on the stream here in any game. You don't need any mods for this. And... Uh, trying to lose the wrench. <laughs> nah, he's good. He's still got an archive, JPEG. So he's good. Plus, I stole his shit, so, I mean, when I steal your shit, you automatically get the rent. <laughs> like, I'm going to steal Clinton's shit today, I'm gonna, if I'm going to try to. I'm going to try to get around to that, because it's, uh... Because that little roadside eatery was just, it was tits. I was like, oh my god, that thing, I'm, I'm so stealing. As soon as I laid eyes on it, I'm like, oh, I'm fucking stealing this, man. I don't know how, I don't know where, but I am totally, totally going to steal this. Without question, without doubt. In fact, I should probably put another one of those here. Yeah, put another one of those there. Sure. And then, um, what time is it? 5.10? Yeah, I should probably just go ahead and rest here. Don't that we have no builders here? <laughs> Shit. Holly, hey, Lena, you don't be like that, nah? Nah? Is Clint here today? No, he's not here today, but JPEG, if you look in the description, I linked it. It's, he did it for the, uh, he did it for the, um, the three floor challenge. And it was actually three floors. He did a really good job with it. He used that corner snappy piece to check likes that I can't use. But he uses an outdoor wall. I was like, oh my god, that's fucking brilliant. I'm totally stealing that too. <laughs> What's going to be interesting is later on when I actually get around to doing and stop fucking around with this, this roof here is uh, we're going to try and uh, duplicate, duplicate it from memory, which should be exciting. And... Um, Duplicate it from memory so I can and then and then modify it. I don't like the way you say actually through. Well, I mean he stayed within he stayed within the boundaries, he stayed within the boundaries of the boundaries, you know. And like not like I did with the awnings. The awnings were not uh, were not kosher. I mean G4 liked the build. I don't just like you know, but it it was it was technically not quite right, which admittedly is fine. I will, um, 
But I've got another one in the FNG's got uh the FNG has a build that I did. I posted links, I posted a couple screenshots on my Discord. And I was just farting around with it. I'm like, you know what, let's see what let's see what I can do inside those borders and I wanna make a scavenge hack. And I gotta say it came out I'm not quite sure how it came out, to be honest with you. I'm not uh What? Oh, it's got to be higher. Duh. Um, but yeah, I'll probably be feature. I'll probably be showing you guys that one next time I play the FNG. Because Sheck was like, "Are you going to tour it?" I'm like, "I don't know. Yeah, I guess. Like, I can show you. It's not going anywhere." But um, yeah. <laughs> Let's see here. Well, I know, I, I had to decorate it, though, and I'm working on... See, the thing is, JPEG, on the FNG, I'm working on Sanctuary for Helene's. Well, it wasn't really going to be Helene's... It wasn't really intended to be Helene's Challenge, but I'm like, well, I've got this thing in progress anyways, and it meets the criteria. But uh, when you saw that, I don't know if you saw that, I'm building a little player home, fledgling town-like thing at Sanctuary, and... Um, I, uh... What the hell is even happening with this? And uh, what happened was, what had happened was, I uh, I couldn't figure out what to do. I got the, you know, I got the the settlers' houses up, and I got the player houses up, and I'm like, okay, cool. But then I got stuck with what am I going to do with the inside of the yellow house? Because so I wanted to make a doctor's office, right? I was thinking about it, but then that wasn't working, and I just I was like, what the fuck am I going to turn this into? And then I had inspiration the other day. And now it's turning into something completely different, but I've got it. I've got a plan now. So you may, we may see more of that on Tuesday. Um, if I'm, you know, like I said, if I'm not dead from work and I'm, I'm actually up for doing whatever, um, I'll bust out the FNG and we'll, um, I'll uh, go for, uh, I'll go for uh, maybe decorate it, you know. Okay, we got that. Now, shit, that's too high, isn't it? Well, let's go inside and look. Let's see what we got inside. Okay, so the fan's on. Good. Is the light inside here on? Yes. The light inside there is on. Good. Is the light inside here on? No. Okay. So we need to drag it around the side in the back. Um. RP says a double threat. Face for radio, no voice for silent movies. I got a voice for it. I got a perfect, in a band, my voice is perfect for the drums. <laughs> That's the way I put it. It's like, yeah, yeah, I got a drummer's voice, baby. And not Phil Collins, but more, uh, more traditional. Um, so yeah, we'll see, we'll see some, uh, well, shit, what am I going to do here? RH 2021, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Just want to say I love your builds for some kind of live stream. Well, thanks for the kind words, man. I'm glad this stuff is uh, useful. I'm glad you're enjoying the shoe. Uh, so what is this going to be here? I need to put this in the building somehow. Yeah? I need to put this in the building. It's got to go in the building. So if I do it, what, here? That'd look pretty cool if I do it there. Right? I do it? Well, come on. Go there. Actually, I'm just going to put it there. That'll be even better, right? Sure. We'll just put it there. Fuck it. Okay, so now it is just above the first floor. And it is... Okay, so it's right here, right? So if I go inside, and I go to the right, it's right behind this thing, isn't it? That is not where I want it. I want it higher. Okay, let's put it higher. Let's put it higher. Yeah, we need it way up there at the top. Okay. Up you go, big fella. Way the fuck up there. Yes. Okay. Now we go back inside and add more conduits. Now I got some elevation here. Okay, so it's... It's like right. Hmm. Shit, I can't see. 
Is my light on? My light is not on. All right. Dun, 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 dun. You might stream Monday? Oh, if you stream Monday, I can catch that, dude. So, maybe that's, maybe that's a reason not to stream on Monday, eh? <laughs> I can't do Wednesdays, unfortunately, because that's my, that's my socialization night. But Mondays, I could totally do. Oh, come on. Come on, man. Why you gotta do this? Oh, what am I doing? I'm dumb. Go over here. I can totally see it from this angle. Or not. Okay, this is the difficulty with building inside. Now I can't see above this thing. Maybe I can just do this. Yeah. There we go. Aha! Alright. So now we got that. And, uh... Booty call, not an update. It's not booty call, dude. That's where I, that's where I get my socialization. My, my pop culture... My pop culture, uh... Catching up. Okay. Let's do that. Okay, let's grab this. Let's grab this and see where the wall... See where it comes out of the wall. Let's do that. Man, this pipe, I can't get... <laughs> I can't get down. <laughs> okay, come on. Let's go hook that wire up. Okay, this is taking a lot longer than I thought it was going to, folks. Okay, it looks like it's going straight. So now, let's go back up inside the building. And... Okay, where was I... What was I even doing here? Move this shit out of the way here. Yeah, that looks pretty straight. That looks pretty straight. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to do... Hmm. Oh, no. Come on. It'd be cool if I could string it to that. Can I string it to that? Uh, okay, chat's going really fast, so if you're asking me things, or if I miss things, um, feel free to hit me with the at Sardeliac so I see the orange thing and I can, uh, I can address your question. Um... And it totally looks like I should be able to get something in there, huh? Can I just drop it on there? No, right? Well, kinda? It goes right through there, though, which is convenient. Hmm. Man, it almost goes over there, too. Look at that. It almost goes over there. Hmm. Yeah. To hell it. It's fine. It's close enough, man. No one's gonna know the difference. There'll be a couple of wires coming out. I don't care. I don't care. I'm fiddling around with it too goddamn much. Okay, so here. Goes to the roof a little bit, but I don't care. And then, um, can I get out from the other side? See, wiring is the most boring shit ever. I mean, it's got to be done, you know. It's very useful. Can I get the wire? Yeah, I can, I can do that there. Okay, good. So if we do that, and we do this. Is that close? I can't believe it goes right through there, though. That is pretty fascinating. Pretty fascinating that it will actually go through those little, uh, those little things there. So we'll get double wires going. Sure, why not? Yeah, whatever. Looks kind of nice. I don't like that going to the ceiling, though. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Okay, so we're going to unhook you. Come on. Where's the wire? that one so I can do this yeah. come on you can do it it's almost there come on right there okay 
Now we're gonna hook it back up to the outside. Yeah. Come on. Okay. All right. We're getting there. 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 You're on PS4. Yeah, a lot of builders here are on PS4. Okay, so you are absolutely not alone. In fact, the majority of them are on PS4. I would I would wager, right? I mean, there's only on Xbox. It's me and Nikita and John. Most everybody else is on PS4. Dun, dun, dun. That's why I had to learn the. So I had to learn the uh, the functions for the. Um... Yeah, that's cute. Okay, cool. Now I'm gonna store you. Okay. Do I get light back here now? Is there enough? Oh, that's right. I gotta pick it up, don't I? Oh no, that's right. Nikita's on PC too. There it is. There's my light. All right. So now he's got a light on his desk. All that for one light. Let's quick save. Da, 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 da. When was my last save? <laughs> See, I'm getting there, Javik. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. <laughs> so I'm getting the timing down. Nice. Okay, good. Good. All right, so I am getting the timing down. And then uh, we're going to put some light in here. Let's just put one of those track lights in here, just for the hell of it. Da, 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 da. Let's see, let's hit that thing. Oh, don't do that. Don't move the barrels. I'm going to move you over to about here. That's good, yeah. Does that light it up? Oh, yeah. Little storage closet. It's so cute. You know you can hook up an Xbox controller. Yeah, no, he's he's right. I use controller on PC. So, um, I just, I stream, I like to stream on the Xbox because that's what I started with. But, uh, you don't need a wire controller, John. You can use a Bluetooth controller. You can use a wireless controller for it. You just sync it to a control panel and it works just fine. I just prefer wired because the response time is slightly better. Slightly better. Um... Yeah, I got the lantern there, got this there, got the wires there. Okay. And then I've got light through the whole back of this place. In fact, I could probably just stick a light up on top of this thing right now, can't I? Yeah, just put it... Yeah, there we go. Totally random and... Totally random and funky. But it does light up the inside of this place pretty nicely now. Good. And then I could run wires back here if I needed to along the top. But I've got enough light back here from the existing shit, so I don't think I'm going to need to do that. <sighs> I think it's because it's an older one. Yeah, if it's an older controller, if it's got that weird... Um, if it's got that weird uh, plastic section around the Xbox button, then yeah, it won't work with the... It won't work. It's got to be one of the new ones that's got the smooth, the smooth case. Okay, so we got that, we got this. We need turrets. Turrets, turrets, turrets. I need turrets. Um, yeah, let's just do the same thing I did with the other ones. Consistency is the key, yeah? Yeah, sure. Sure, consistency is the key. And turrets. Da, da, da. La -dee -dee. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Come on. There you go. There you go. Come on, grab it. Thank you. And then up. That's centered enough. Doop doo doo. Doop doop doo doo. Okay, there's you. And then your front is where? Where's your front, big guy? Okay, your front is there. Cool. So your front is this way. So the front is pointing towards the back, yeah? Yeah, let's do that. And we'll do it like this. Shoot. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. And your front is... Ah, oh, don't do that. Come on. There we go. Dun, 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 dun. Uh oh. Something's happening. Well, that was quick. Whatever it was died really fast. So, booyah. Okay, there's one. We'll grab the other one. 
Clinton, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Okay, hold on a second, folks. Let me do this really quick. Oh boy. All right. Let's see. Um, here and there. Okay, got that done. Okay. Sorry, I had a little do a little administrative maintenance there, folks. Dude, welcome to the stream, Clinton. Um, how you doing? How is it going today, sir? Okay. And I'm gonna do this. Yeah. Sure. Okay. So now what it looks like from the bottom. Now that the sun's kind of out. Yeah, that's pretty formidable. That's 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 doable. That's doable. That's doable. Now I wonder if that thing sticks out enough to where I could put a string of lights on the bottom of the guard station. Cause these string lights are really aggressive about going up on shit. Okay, come here. You. You'll go down there, but you won't go up there. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> they would look good up there, though, wouldn't they? Do I have a pad here? Okay, let's move you out of the way. And, um... Well, can, can I just stick them to the wall over here? Yeah, it's good enough. Come here. You stay there. What am I doing about these big stairs? This one right here, these stairs here, the whole market's gonna go out in front of it, JB. And I'm gonna put another entrance on the side of it underneath. That is in theory, in theory, the plan. That is in theory, the plan. But as we all know, plans don't often survive contact with the enemy. So we're gonna see how it goes. We're gonna see how it goes. Okay. And see? Oh yeah. Oh, it's hitting those light. What? Is it hitting the inside of the? Oh, it is under there, isn't it? We have a solution for that too, don't we, folks? <laughs> RP Jax, was I a soldier? You mean like was I active in the military? No. No. I'm curious why you're asking though. Dun, 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 yeah. Do this one. And uh Okay, down. Actually, you know what? The thing about the conduit is if you put it to the side, you can do this thing where you can see the angle of it better, yeah? And, okay, so that's the bulb, so it's about right there? Sure. Yeah, okay. Let's try it again. 75th time pays for all, yeah? Yeah, you will do what I want, bitch. Okay, so I want it to go on the bottom of, yeah, right there. I want it to be on the bottom of the thing right like that. And out a little bit. Ah, look at that shit. They're kind of sunk into the thing, but whatever, it's fine. You won't notice it from the front. <laughs> you won't notice it from the front. Okay, see what we got. Yeah! Actually, we should probably look at the whole thing, huh? So now, it looks like that. And Roger's gonna walk underneath it and not, he's not gonna be able to pass to it for a really long time. But that's okay. But that's okay. You've never heard of Murphy's Laws of Combat recorded by civilians? I don't understand that reference, RPJX. But I'm going to assume it's something I said. <laughs> I don't know. I pay attention to a lot of things and I incorporate a lot of things into my vocabulary. But 
Sometimes, yeah, that's really nice. You can see almost the entire goddamn settlement from up here. I can see my house from up here. And then you can shoot out the sides here, overlook the main gate. Yeah, you're totally stealing. Well, you better steal it. It's such a pain in the ass to put together. I really like these little backwards, uh, these little backwards covers though, because I didn't really realize that it would snap onto the back of that frame. But shit, that works pretty good. So there's the uh, there's another fortification for you, Dalton. If you want to use this one for your uh, for your builds, another double turret on the sides, guard in the center. Oh yeah, no plan surprise contact with the enemy. Exactly. Yeah. That's pretty good. Lights it up inside good. It looks nice and solid underneath. And uh, auto saving, very good. Okay, so that's what we've got. That's what we got for the initial build here. And did I leave any pieces? Oh, I gotta put that rug back. I gotta put this rug back. Okay. Oversized carpet there. Okay, so today all we've got is all we've got is this little raggedy ass storage bin with the barrels in it. Did I grab all the barrels from everywhere? I guess I did, didn't I? I was throwing them around a lot last week. Oh, come on. I totally made that Mr. Forklift. You got a piece of shit. Okay, here. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm sitting here. I'm sitting here dumb. Oh, I have ladders, dude. I don't have to sit here and jump. You dipshit. Okay. <laughs> so it's gonna be one of those kind of streams. All right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna wander around, wander around. Uh, okay, so these barrels are scrap only, and that's scrap only. These are scrap only. Nothing over there. I grabbed those out of there. Uh, there's a baseball bat floating in the water. Oh, don't drink, you door. Ah, damn it. Okay. So they must have killed a raider over here. There's a baseball bat. Because they were shooting earlier, right? Didn't they shoot something over here? Because they spawn back here sometimes, right? Don't they? Ain't nobody back here. Hmm. Now... Is that cow? No, the cow's gone. No, when the provisioner, when it reset after I fast travel, the provisioner. Talk. What? Let's trade some things. Sure thing. Well, I thought he said he needed to talk to me. Okay. Well, whatever. Okay, I got some boxes over here. I forgot about those. Okay. Uh, what? In? Okay, they freaking killed somebody over here, man. There's a baseball bat floating in the water. He must have fallen in the water. Is there a raider in this water? Two stim packs and a baseball glove? In the water? Clearly I've never actually explored down here. Um, okay, sure, why not? Sure, why not? The bat was there last stream? Oh, okay. I just wasn't paying attention. That's not, uh... That's not an unknown phenomenon, my friend. <laughs> this is driving me nuts, man. They killed something back here. Eh, whatever. It don't matter. God knows I got enough friggin' loot. Ever since things were bad, I feel like I can't take a break. I don't ever want us to end up back there again. Hey, we won't. Things are better now, much better. We have more than we need. I have nightmares too sometimes. But if we don't the get gate then, how you doing, baby? Welcome to the stream. I give you my word. You and the kids will never go hungry again. I won't let that happen. You and the kids will never go hungry again. Yeah, don't you worry, dude. I got you covered, Roger. You know we're gonna start. Uh, okay, so we got that. So now what we're gonna do is try and start working on this area here because I do want to make this a little caravany outposty. You know what? I'm, this, I'm getting rid of this fucking car. I just don't want that car in the way anymore. I'm going to put this seat away. 
Oh wait, somebody opened the door. Look at that. Maybe it was me. Okay. Put this over here. Put you up there. Yeah. Come here. Come here, car seat. Get your ass up there. Yeah, there we go. Or not. You know, you can, just, you can stay down the floor too, I guess. Okay, that's fine. All right. So you got that. You know what? Let me throw these boxes in here too while I'm thinking about it. Get these out of the way so in the storage area. And fling! My parents used to fight a lot, but not anymore. I'm glad they stopped. Yep. They don't fight anymore because your dad's not your dad. Just so you know. Dun, dun, dun. Spoiler, Janie! Your daddy's dead, but he's also alive. It's crazy in the Commonwealth. But he's not a ghoul either. He's something else entirely. He's an entirely different thing altogether. Okay, just chuck these in there. Um, did that box fall inside? No? I could have swore I had six. I'll watch the stream later. Dun, 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 dun. See, Dad gets it. <laughs> He's an entirely different thing. You know, I want to say one of these boxes, I threw it and it fell inside one of those, uh, fell inside one of them barrels. Dun, dun, dun. I don't think Janie would complain about that, RP. I think she'd be okay with not having, I think she'd be okay with not having a brother at all, <laughs> to be honest with you. No, they didn't fall in there. Maybe it fell through the building or something. I don't know. Peculiar. All right. So let's go out here and let's scope out the next work area. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, so what have we got to work with here? Yeah? We've got... Technically, I've got that area in front of the in front of the blast zone there, but I think I'm going to leave that empty. We may put a fence over here. Uh, the box may be lost. Yeah, it might, it might have just gone through the building, too. It might just pop out when I reload. Who knows? It's no big deal. It's just extra. It's just extra. Damn it, I didn't want to leave that door open because I get distracted by that fusion core generator. Let me go back over here. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there is no door. <laughs> All right, yeah. This is the kind of high quality content that you come here for. Me running around forgetting things. Hooray! The absent minded builder. Okay. So, phase two is we need to put something out here. This is what our next area is going to be. Hold on a second, folks. <laughs> One more single person. person. <laughs> nice. Nice. A scintillating personality, yeah? Inferno Clan Jake, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Okay. So this is what we're going to work with here. This is our next stop. This is the next plan of action. Uh, well, I can get rid of the cooking station because I know I've got I've got um, a stove inside the house now, so I've got that going for me. And we have this, yeah. Okay. Um, I got to adjust my headphones again. Hold on one second, folks. sliding down my head today for some reason I don't know so what in the hell is this going to be I guess I could start because I could just make it I guess I could just make a square right still on a caravan station with the traders uh yeah maybe JPEG maybe I'm kind of on the fence on that one because I know they stop here anyway and I know they stop around that fire you know, as I point at the screen, like you can, I'm shaking my finger at the screen, pointing to the campfire that's burnt out, like you can see it, because, you know, whatever. Um, so there are NPC sit spots around that fire. So if I put, I could just put, you know, a couple of tents over that thing, yeah? Um, 
and uh, but I can make a square right just make the whole thing go along the back there and then along the side down here with the entrance kind of just in the U shape and that way I could block off those stairs a lot easier in theory in theory but what I want to do first is I want to do what I said I was going to do in the description and I'm just going to go ahead straight up and steal Clinton's uh, roadside eatery I'm going to see if I can remember how it was built that's going to be the fun thing let's check our memories yeah check our memories here right so it had it had okay this is going to be rough don't laugh okay this is going to be rough it had this and then it had i'm going to guess a warehouse floor because it there's no half floors that look quite like this so it had that and then it had this metal pre this metal wall on the back my favorite right it had that and then it had because the exit was here so it had uh, it had this wall or this wall it had something like that yeah because that was the counter because the counter No, because that had to be on the back like that. Was there a full floor underneath there? Since there was a full floor underneath there, because then you had the little you had the little steps right for the other side. Um, you had these, right, and then you had this. So we're gonna put this on here. Yeah. We're gonna see how close I get with this thing probably fucking this up in a major way but but you had like the stairs like this yeah they were sort of like this uh, let's go ahead and jack this thing up a little bit come on up you go let's get you over here away from the stairs so I don't pick those up by mistake but then you had like this thing here was where the booths were right so you had this kind of thing going and then you basically just put this, because the stairs were like right here, yeah? So we're going to put the stairs, shh, come on. This is probably not going to be, you know, even close to being accurate, but whatever. Because it was like that, yeah? Then you had the barn and warehouse walls there, but I don't want to use those. I'm going to use, um, I'm going to use these, yeah? And then this, oh, come on, you piece of shit. Oh, the stairs, it's the stairs. Not the groups like that in there. But it was like that, I think, yeah? Something like that? Then he had stairs in the front, I remember that. He had probably these stairs here, the little short warehouse stairs like that, because he can do those in the middle. Yeah, and then he had, what, that one wall that I barely ever use, that I used earlier because I, I had it on the brain. I had this one here, yeah? And then you've got what? And I know for sure he had a shack bridge underneath this bad boy in the back. Because I saw him like, oh yeah, I recognize that. So we're going to do that. Um, yeah, let's grab that shack bridge here. And you're going to jam it under the back here and see what we can get. Hold on a second, folks. Pause. People sleeping is coming on strong. See? I'm a soporific, baby. Look that up. My streams are soporifics. I'm glad you stopped by, John. I hope you have a pleasant and uh, a pleasant nap. Oh man, come on. Don't be like this. I gotta raise it even more. Shit, where's my... Uh... Let's raise it up even more. I'll just pick it up a little bit more here. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Come on, up you go. There we go. Just need a little more hide under the back. And... Do this. Okay, I got a little itch in my throat here, so I may have to be coughing a little more than normal. I don't know what's going on here. I need some more water, I guess. Too much talking. Too much talking. Come on, man. Don't be like that. There you go. And up. And in. And 
Come on. Oh, you bastard. Well, that's... Okay. I went into build mode. It dropped the item. Then I went back into build mode, and it vanished. It went back to where it was. That's weird. That's weird. Those two posts from contraptions. Yeah, those are the marble tracks. Those are these. Okay. Yes, they're from contraptions. They're the ball track supports. They're these. You find them in the you find them in the ball track tab. I like them because they're they're like they act like concrete pillars, but they're taller. They're slightly taller. They have a they have a variety of uses that the concrete pillar cannot duplicate. And yes, they're absolutely in the one with the wrench is contraptions. Yeah. Because Wasteland Workshop's the Deathclaw head, and then the gear is uh, Vault Tech. Do that, and then we'll stick another wall up on the side here. Probably should pull the wall up first, because I know the walls don't like those bridges, but whatever! We'll do that here. Yeah, this one here will work. And, uh, okay, if I'm missing anything, please let me know again, guys. Again, chat's going really fast, and I'm concentrating on trying to remember something I only saw briefly. Well, I mean, I did kind of give it attention the second time through, because I was like, but the first time I was like, fuck, this thing is fucking cool. I'm, I'm stealing this. Somehow, some way, I am taking this. I don't care. It's friggin' awesome. Probably not exact, but it's good enough for my purposes because I just need the template for it. So I can take it apart and modify it for the needs that I need to put it to. That's what we do here with stealing. Okay, this is why I call it stealing because I'm just basically duplicating what I think he did or as close as possible to what I remember it being. Because I know we used a lot of uh, wood and, I mean, barn and warehouse walls on this thing. To get the height which is fine and then over here I'll just put another wall there and just put that there for now because yeah he had he had a warehouse he had a warehouse wall across the middle here which makes an excellent counter height by the way that was really friggin smart where is it oh it's here but yeah, you had this thing in the halfway mark. Yeah, and you can just place that. Wow, look at that. Oh, did you sink it through the floor? Oh, you little shit. You did, huh? This thing's too tall. So you actually fired that thing to the floor. Nice. Nice. Yeah, because it wasn't that tall. It was half height. Nice. You heading out, Barbarian King? All right, man. Thanks for stopping by. Good to see you as always. Hope you enjoyed the shoe. You fired it through, you little shit. All right. All right. All right. We can do that. I can do that, too. And we'll do that, and then we'll grab my pillar, which is back here. There. Yeah, let's do that. You did barn or warehouse, but you put them in regular wood wall. Okay, so I've got the height wrong. That's all right. I'm getting close, man. That's that's what we're doing. We're just get Good enough for government work, yeah? Just trying to get close to what I to what I remember seeing you do. Yeah, see something like that's that's cute as hell. Look at that. If I can get it to go there. Okay, right about there we go. There it is. Yeah, that's cute. I should probably put the store counter in first so I get the height right. But good enough. Is that? No, that can't be at the right spot. It's got to be further back. It's got to be further back. Shit. That's all right. That's all right. This is what I mean by stealing, right? I take what somebody else has done, and I'm like, okay. I try to do it from memory, and then I build it, adding my barn wall is four floorboards higher than wood wall. Barn wall is four floorboards. Oh, you mean like if you put four, if you stack four floor pieces on top of each other? Is that the thickness you're talking about, Clinton? Is that the uh, the measurement you're referring to here? I never was a fan of the whole stacking the uh, stacking the uh, the floors thing. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So I am understanding that at least. Yay! I'm slow, man, but I get there. 
And then here. That's about right. Right about there. Sure. Yeah, close enough. It's fun. That is so cute, though. And the shelves in the front with the stools. I'm like, yeah, that's, that's pretty sweet. Okay, so we got that. And then it's it's gapping, but I don't care. I'll deal with it later. I'm just trying to get the uh, trying to get the general feel for the thing. Yeah. Yeah, I'll we'll just put any trader store here so we can see the height. Ah, you piece of crap. I fell out the back. Yeah, that's that's about right. I mean, it's a little bit low, but it'll do. Yeah. Then you have a different kind of roof that I don't remember what was on there. And there was the barn roofs on this because you had this height differential here. Gail, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. But anyway, this is what, this is the what, this type of process is what I hope you guys do with my shit. <laughs> As you take it, you're all, that's a really cool idea. What can I do with it? And then as you build it, right, as you go through the motions of building it and reproducing it, you get to, you automatically put your own style on it. Because that's what you do. That's how you build, right? I mean, at first, you know, you're gonna be you're gonna be duplicating things as closely as possible because you don't have a style yet. But once you have a style, it all becomes second nature very very quickly. Oh, it's hitting fire there. So yeah, that's the basic form factor of this thing. Yeah. Now, if it was me, I would probably put a wood roof on this instead because I like that. Uh, I like that uh, for funky shops. I like this roof here. Because it lets a lot of natural light in there. And then on the front, of course, he had uh, what the barn wall on the right, and then he had he had a warehouse wall, I think, on the left. I don't remember, but whatever. We're gonna see what I can get in there. But it was like this one on the side here. Oh, you know what you can do is I can take that piece. I don't have that wood piece anymore, do I? That floor piece. Uh, Warehouse floors. Yeah, I didn't. I scrapped it. I didn't store it. Come on, snap. Okay, you snap there, and then we'll get the barn piece out. Because I'm pretty sure it was the barn door frame piece on the right. Because it had that lintel thing across the top. No, it's not that one. It's this one. Yeah, it won't snap there, will it? Okay, fine. It'll snap there now. Yeah, it was like this. The opening was like that. And then you take your concrete pillar. And this thing will probably snap back, so it's moving out of the way. And if it doesn't, I'll just use scaffolding. I don't really care. Build order, build order, build order. Yeah, it's... I just, I don't really use barn and warehouse pieces that much, you know? So I don't instinctively have the knowledge of which goes with what where, you know? Yeah, let's go inside and do this. Yeah, it's easier to line up on the... But I can't see the top. <laughs> no, I can, because once it hits the top, it'll turn red. So we go in here. Yeah. Line you up in here. So you go about there. Yeah. Yeah, just like that. And then up. Um, okay, that goes up a lot higher than I was expecting. Yeah, it's not it's not actually hitting the roof, is it? Well, I got to guess. Ah, uh, shit. I need to do it from the side. Okay. What I need to do more than that is move this over here so I can see the damn thing. Yeah, there we go. There we go. So you can slide it right to the wall. Yeah. Line it up, pull it down and forward. No. Yeah, let's do that. Lower it so I can see it when I drop it. Yeah. Pull it forward, pull it forward, pull it forward. Up. And in, and... Come on. How's that? Yeah, that's reasonable. Now, the question is, will this snap back in? The answer is no. But that's why we have group select. Hey, look, I come, I, I defended 10 Pines Bluff. That's how uber I am. 
I can defend ten pines bluff without even friggin' being there. Yeah, there we go. Okay, it's not straight. Let's try it again. <laughs> Let's try it again. But yeah, so this is the basic, this is not an exact duplicate, but it's, it's close. Yeah. Yeah, because he had a red rocket thing on my head, or one of those rockets up on the top. Probably use a different, uh, trying to catch some Z's. All right, Yulia, thanks for stopping by. Hope you had a good time. Captain Drastic, welcome to the stream, sir. How you doing? So, okay, so this is in, in the main, in the very, in its most basic form. I mean, it's missing this whole section here with the boots, and it's missing the little dress on dress up on the side, and it's missing uh, the little the little wall piece, which was like right over here. No, not floors, walls, because he had this thing in there, and he buried it on the side to make a little like corral thing, and I'm pretty sure that went over like this. Was it, was it like this? It was over here. What did it, or was it here? Was it around the back like this? I don't remember. I can visualize the side of the cafe, but I can't visualize what was here. I remember seeing, maybe it was a different wall. No. No, he had... What was that piece? Because I remember seeing a weapon rack on it. And it was like a, a wall piece sunk down. Yeah? Yeah, the makeshift cooking station was back... It was back behind... Well, it was behind here then, wasn't it? It was right here. He did it. He just dropped it right here. Because the whole thing, the whole... Yeah, because it was the ice machine that was sticking on the side. Right. Okay. So it's kind of like this. Something like that. Something like that. Why am I stressing about flaws for reproduction? Because I want to see the skeleton of it, Dag. I want to see the bones of it. I want to get it... Because the whole thing, right, when you get builds like that, yeah? Oh, well, looks like a defending gray garden, too. When it comes to stealing things, right, this is what I used to do when I was building with Bethesda shit, when I was trying to learn their stuff, right? What... Where I get the value is reproducing the actual thing as closely as possible. That way, I get the bones of the structure, I get a feel for, I get a feel for, an instinctive feel for the builder's method, right? And by having to put it together the way they did, it forces me sometimes to build things out of order or in different ways that I did. It also tests your memory to see if you can actually remember how it worked. Now, he used a full-size ladder here, but probably should have used a half-size ladder. Because those things fit better on the sides of those, uh, those things. But that's just a style preference. But anyway, building the entire structure as it appears as best you can from memory will often teach you things about the building process that you literally could not have learned any other way. Because you're trying to duplicate somebody else's thinking. Somebody else's method, somebody else's style. And you will learn more about build order, and you will learn about um, spacing, gaps, structures. I swear to God, this is not right. This is not right. It's got to go halfway. There was something else right here. It was like the other half wall. I swear to God, there was something else in there. Of course, I could just be misremembering, which is you know, a very high likelihood as well. But I want to say it was this wall here. I want to say it was this wall here. But anyway, it's, it's just part of the methods on... It's like if you're an artist, if you're a painter, and you try to paint in Pollock style, Picasso style. You try to other styles out, right? Because that will teach you a lot about the building process or the painting process that you could not have done any other way. And it might give you ideas on how to... It's not right either. I, I, I'm not remembering... Ah, eh, well, whatever. It's fine. But there was something here, because I remember seeing, I remember seeing, because there was an ice machine out here, and there was this wall here. I know it was this wall. It had to be this wall. 
Um, Sai, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. So, that's why when I say steal my shit, I'm not kidding. It, it will help you with your build style because you will try things that you would not have otherwise done. You will, it'll get you out of your muscle memory, get you out of your groove, and it'll, you'll start to think, look at things, approach things in a different way. And, um, so that's, that's why I do it this way. That's why I'm so hell bent on getting this thing as close to original in terms of how it was put together because he approaches things a different way, right? When he put it together, he built it his way. So I'm trying to build what he did, but my way. And it doesn't work because it doesn't go together like that. So I'm having to do things that I would not have otherwise done or trying to figure things out that I would it would never have occurred. Like this structure here, right? The uh, barn on the, the warehouse on the left, barn on the right, snap together. The build order thing that David mentioned. I don't use these pieces, right? So I already learned something. Saying when you snap these pieces together, you have to snap this door frame in first. Yeah? I was correct on that corner piece. Okay, correct. Which way was correct? Halfway in or all the way in, JPEG? It was buttered up against... Was it buttered up against the back of the... Was it buttered up against the back of the, of the thing here? Like this? And see, I don't remember what he had here as a piece. I don't remember what he had here as a piece. I don't remember how he filled this gap back here. Okay, so it, it goes all the way out in the corner. All right. So yeah, but anyway, I guess this this is a good uh, this is a good little digression, right? On how to on how to um, on how to uh, increase your building palette. Yeah, add more colors, styles, methods, techniques to your building style. Yeah. But see, that it's the details that kill me, right? Like, this thing here, I know it was, like, right here, yeah? And then there was, like, an ice machine right here. And then there was a the little fire pit thing here with, uh, with the, I would look like a bookcase and some, some, uh, warehouse pillars, right? Um, and then, you know, you just patch that up underneath here. And I know, I remember he patched this wall with, uh, with the railing, I remember that. I remember he stuffed this railing underneath there. I recognize it because one of my favorite dodges, because <laughs> it's like that piece really goes underneath there really well. It's a very good piece to use, and it, you can group slate from a pretty good distance away. But I remember seeing this piece under there, going, "Aha, you sneaky little bastard!" Because it just goes like right there. Yeah, it fits real good. It goes in there real nice. Okay, so you got that supported there. That's supported there. I don't remember what he did under here. Probably passed it up. I don't remember. Buh, 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 buh. How you doing, old timer? Joining that senior discount? Not, not, not yet. Not yet. We're a couple months out from that. A couple months out from that. But anyway, so this is the basic structure. Yeah. I don't know quite how he did. Cause I don't. Do they snap to these? They do. Okay, so that's how he did it. They do snap to these, because he had this piece with this thing here. No. No, he didn't. It wasn't that tall. He had glass, but he must have done... He must have done this piece, and then sunk it. Because the other thing was too... It was too tall. I think. See, now this is where my memory's really, really shit in the bed, right? Because you got that, yeah. And you have this. Small stairs back with a small gap. I like, like, like I said, Rob. I'm just, I'm still trying to, still trying to duplicate the structure. Uh, after that, I'm gonna like tear it down, recreate it, whatever. But yeah, because the boots, right? You could see the boots could see over the side of the wall, so it looked like that kind of. But that ain't right either. Am I misremembering how tall that wall was? I must be. And see, this also tests your build, your building skill, right? Because I remember the booths were there, right? And booths are in the furniture miscellaneous, or they're in chairs. Let's see if we can get the height right. See, this is where you get. This is where you get to the end of the. Of the this is where you get to the end of the, of the confusion part because you're like, I remember. 
this being X, Y, and Z, but I don't remember the other thing being... Okay. No, don't store the shack floor. And see, normally what I would do is if I was really trying to seriously duplicate this, at this point I would stop, go back and look at the video again and say, okay, what am I missing? Okay, those things are wider than the than the walls there. That's um interesting. No way a wall's gonna snap on that though, right? Not without booze in the way. No. Not with the stairs in the way either, but the stairs, yeah, the stairs can't go in there because they snap. Yeah. Half walls. So th is this right? Ah, that, that's okay. I'm not going to worry about it. We're not going to deal with it. We're going to quick save this. Yeah. We'll sit in the booth. Just sit in this booth right here and get the daytime out. My favorite wood wall on the right. Okay. All right. You made me turn my Xbox on. Don't, don't, don't do, don't judge. No, no judging my work, dude. I'm, like I said, I'm duplicating just from memory. My memory's not that good. But, uh, but yeah, I think I've got, I think I've got about, I'm going to say about 75% of the bones of the structure pretty much correct. The details are a little bit wrong, but this is fundamentally almost what it is. It ain't perfect. It's not an exact duplicate, but it's got the major themes, right? It's got the stairway with the barn stuff. It's got the half height counter. It's got this thing out to the booths. Yeah. And there was a little table here with a radio. I remember it's got that little that little fancy table with the radio. It was right there. And then it had the exit to the outside down here where this was cooking. So, okay. So that's the basic. That's the basic stuff, yeah? Da, 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 da. So we're gonna, now we're going to take it and we're going to make it our own. But first, we're going to go ahead and take a little break because it's misting and I need to fucking stretch and get some more water because my throat is totally tickling. So... We'll do the old three to five minutes, guys. Smoke them if you got them. Refill your drinks and snacks, and I will be right back.
right, and we are back. Let's go ahead and sit back down here and catch up a little bit on here. Uh, welcome to anybody that joined when I was AFK. And uh, got to go. All right, from the Geek Den. Thanks for stopping by, man. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so if I missed anything, if y'all want to know anything, let me know. Uh, let me get sit you put my back support in here. Oh, God. Old bones are popping and shit. Okay, so now more conceptualizing as we reconstruct whatever this thing is here okay so now that i got the bones of it i'm gonna scrap these scrap this okay everything about okay yeah it's just the normal thing you know and when i sit for long periods of time i got to get up and walk around and stretch a little bit refill my water so i don't be hacking and wheezing into the thing so um on the topic of stealing other people's shit and teaching you other things and teaching you how to notice things when you when you watch how a build's put together because a lot of the times the signature stuff is the details right is the detail stuff that builders almost always reach for because that's the way they like to build like when people see my builds I, i've gotten comments like all the time as soon as i laid eyes on it, i knew it was yours because i have a certain way of approaching things yeah gray haired gamer how you doing welcome to the stream but studying other builder stuff you'll learn to recognize those signatures and they will become familiar to you like for instance um bethesda structures right the structures that came in the game the raider camps in the game yeah you can tell that they're all the same kind of scrappy style right Everybody, it, the whole game, the Raiders have a certain signature that you look at, okay. But you know, you know that there was more than one person building those things, right? They probably had a team of maybe, what, 10, 15 people doing nothing but building, right? Constructing these things in the CK. And if you duplicate their stuff, after a while, you will learn the signatures of certain of their, of certain of their builders. Like, the people, the person that built, the person who probably built most of the gunner stuff right they do a thing that i see and it immediately it's immediately recognizable and it's it's this let me show you here so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make that thing but i'm gonna show you this first once you start stealing bethesda stuff and looking at their and looking at how their stuff's put together and trying to duplicate it right you will learn that there are certain things that are like trademarks of certain builders one of which is this let me show you here uh Let's just get this thing here, right? There's one builder who builds the gunner things that likes to do this. This thing here is their signature. They'll put a half wall. I'm, I'm duplicating. I'm simulating that right now because I don't have a half wall. But they'll have a half wall underneath this, yeah? And then what they'll do is they'll put a stairway, the wood stairs, uh, the wood stairs here like this but they won't snap the stairs they won't snap the stairs to the piece they'll put the stairs right about here so that the whole unit when you look at the whole unit the third step up is actually just going up into the unit right once you notice this little flourish you see it everywhere you, I mean, you see it everywhere. Every time you see it, you're like, okay, the same person built this as that last thing I liked, right? Because they do this same sort of dodge over and over and over because that's what they like to do. Uh, another one is, that's why I'm, I'm almost, I'm, that's why I'm fairly certain that uh, a lot of the gunner stuff was built by the same person. Same thing with, uh, same thing with um, wires, using cables for support. Once you see that, because not all the Raiders use cables for support. Only certain ones do, and then only in certain places. But once you learn to spot that, you will learn. You, you'll take a look at Lynn Wood, right? With the cables and shit, and then the free-floating bridges and shit like that. And then you go into Kendall Hospital, and you see the same goddamn thing. You're like, okay, the same person built those two, or the same team did. Because it's the same sort of overall feel, but it's the kind of thing that you don't really notice unless you're trying to duplicate it. Yeah, Plaz, what's up, baby? Welcome to the stream. Is it ironic the players build better shit than the people who made the game? No. 
It is not ironic. In fact, Sai, it is expected. It is it is completely unsurprising. It is completely unsurprising. Because the players the players not only have access to the examples of the people who built the game, but they have the time to do nothing but build with a stable, solid, unchanging, simple interface method. Right? It's absolutely unsurprising. Morph, what's up, baby? Welcome to the stream. So that's why it is completely unsurprising that players are able to build comparable, if not in some cases, quote unquote, superior stuff, because we have more time, we have more time, no pressure, no deadlines. And, you know, the the game doesn't change for us. Right now on the, on the downside, we don't get to say, I want these resources. Hey, art team, can you make me some more wood walls? Because I want to do this X, Y and Z with this thing. So, yeah, we have we have the advantage of having a stable engine, an unchanging method, uh, a fairly simple interface, because building the CK is fucking horrifying. Um, and like that. So we can apply, we can practice better. You know, we have a, we, we have a more stable, a more stable base to work from, if that makes sense. Okay, so what am I going to do with this? What do I want to make out of this? Plus the devs have to build 20 times more than our little settlements. Well, they do. RH, but on the other side of the coin, they get to work on it eight hours a day, and there's like 30 of them. Yeah? So, I mean, because you've seen me build in this thing, right? I can throw up a settlement like 20 hours. So if I had a full work week, and they said, hey, we need something in Linwood, shit, no problem, dude. But if I had to deal with the CK, if I had to deal with ever-changing art assets, if I had to deal with changing design specs, uh, engine limitations, and shit like that, I, I would lose my mind. I would just, I would just go berserk. Because I'd be okay, that's great. You you built this thing in 20 hours. It looks fantastic. You need to tear half of it down because it's too many polys. Or we changed the cell next door to it. Now you can't do this and shit. So I, I bleh. so yeah, no, it's it's the same, but it's a lot different. It's a lot different, man. It's the difference between it's, it's the difference between engineering a car and repairing a car in your driveway. I mean, it's the same skill set, but yeah, no. <laughs> Mad respect for the people who put this together. That it works as well as it does. With as few as with as few relative errors that it has. So what am I going to do with this? Um. All right. So yeah. Thanks for coming to my TED talk. Now. But anyway, that's why it, you, that's why building that's why learning to build that's why stealing from the people is so useful because it gives you. It gives you the ability to solve problems in different ways that teaches you things about how to solve problems in different ways. As redundant as that sounds, it's actually a... What? How am I going to change this? What is this going to be? Okay, this has got to go. That doesn't work for me. I do like this entrance, though. I like this entrance a lot. I like the little wings on the sides. I am a huge fan of the wings on the sides. Uh, that's going to go. I'll figure something out with that later. That's that's bad. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some snap action going here. Okay, so that is snapped to there. And if I snap this to here... Okay, now that's snapped. So, first decide where. Oh, I'm going to put this uh, Winterbeard. I know where this is going to go already. It's going to go, this is going to be the back. This is going to go, it's going to go against that chain link fence in the corner. It's going to basically face this way, and it's going to extend from that back corner uh, over there, all the way down the ridge line here to over here to sort of make a pseudo entrance from its other side. Yeah? So that's what I, that's the... Uh, the theoretical plan because if I build this thing here along the outside then I can fill this in later and it'll be easier to make this workshop right here yeah use a bus I don't like using those things in the Inferno clan Jake I don't like buses I don't like the big trailers and shit I've just never been a fan of them I like this little the little wing part of it though the little wing part is cool as fuck 
So maybe make it symmetrical? Think that'll work? So if I do this, put the other stairway on it. Because I really like that little wing, the little elevated wing. It was just cool as hell. I love that look. I'll just have to float the floor up underneath it later. Oh, and another signature. While I'm while I'm babbling on about Bethesda shit, another signature is one of their builders loves those free floating supports. They don't like to use the uh, they don't like to use the shack foundation ones. They don't like to use this, but they'll use the ones with. It's like I don't know how to describe it. It's 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 three supports. It's three angled supports that fits under a half wall. Yeah. It's three angle supports that fit under half wall. They use that piece and the free floating supports that look like this without the top a lot. Uh, you see it at uh, you see it at the forge. You see it at Saugus Ironworks. That guard tower in the front. Those free floating things there. Have I built at Echo Lake? Yeah, I, I tried building an Echo Lake. Um, shoo. That one and Egret Tours were daunting daunting they were not uh but by a higher level the same height as the booth areas up down i don't know i i, I kind of like the whole i kind of like i'm kind of thinking symmetry on this but i might i might put that um um how do i want to do this what do i want to do with this i mean really that's 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 the that's the takeaway here egret may have been daunting yeah i've just don't, even to this day gracho i still i'm like meh it's not, uh, I just was not feeling that build, man, at all. Just at all. I mean, even thinking about it right now, I'm just like, eh, eh. It's like, oh, whatever. It is what it is. Um, let's go, what? Where's the flat top wall here? Yeah, yeah see, now that floor snapped. Nice! Nice! Now if I do that and I put a railing, will scaffolding snap in here? Right now I'm just experimenting, folks. Okay, this is, this is. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't really know where I'm going with it. I'm just kind of playing around with stuff on the original form factor, trying to get it to work. Okay, build order. Maybe that'll snap underneath once I get the other piece in. Maybe the other piece won't go in with that wall there. I won't go in there. Sucks. It'd be cool if it did. It would look really totally tits right there. Um, um, okay, how wetted am I to having that piece in there? That's really the question we have right now. How badly do I want this piece to go in there? And in fact, can I instead do it the other way? Let's try the other way. Maybe the other way will work. Uh, there's no wood floors. Wood floor. Yeah. Yeah. No, not there. I want you down here. Come on. Come on. Go down. Come on. Go down. Piece of shit. There. Okay. So if I do this one on the outside, then I can do this one in here. Well, would you look at that? Build order shenanigans for the motherfucking win. Okay, I'll take you out and then see a scaffolding move back in there. Which it does! Okay, so that's kind of cool. We got a little storage area down here now. That's pretty special. Ben, what up? Welcome to the stream. How late are you? We just did the intermission, dude, so we're about halfway done. Remember, we go till uh, 4 o'clock your time. That's pretty nice. That's. That's kind of interesting, actually. 
Yeah? Not too shabby. Build order for the win, baby. I can't believe it snapped on the, on the floor underneath, but that's all right. I'll take it. I will fucking take it. Okay, so if I do that, I'm going to need to do... I almost used that thing as group slide. I've been building in vanilla no DLC for so long. I see a little ladder. I'm like, oh, there's my... That's my... Uh, that's my... Uh, that's my dodge, right? That's what I use for uh, my group selecting shit. So whenever I see it, I'm like, okay, that's my group select piece. Since I don't have a pillar. Okay, let's do this. Put you in there. Yeah? Okay. Come on, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick it up. Oh man, you're not gonna be you're gonna be like that? Fine. I'm gonna conduit your ass then. Okay, we're getting a little chuggy here for some reason. I don't like that. Not a fan of that. Yeah, you're going in there, you little shit. I don't friggin' care. Up you go. And here. And do it like that so I can see. That's the nice thing about the conduit, right? Is you can place it at an angle so you can see straight ahead and you can still put it up underneath there. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this underneath here. I've got the wrong way because of course I do because hey. Okay, let's try that. No, no, like this. Shaq, what's up, baby? Welcome to the stream. Morse Compact Series of Egrets. Well, link that shit up, Morph. Link up uh, your recent installments so people can go check that shit out. That's how we do it here. Yeah, so you put that under there. Yeah, give it a little bit of depth, a little bit of support, and right there. Sure. Of course, I'm probably going to tear all this thing down later, but it's fun to build right now. I'll just go out the your ass. And, yeah, I talk trash to my uh, I talk trash to my video games. It's it's therapeutic. It's therapeutic, RP. It's therapeutic. Or so I tell myself. Yeah. Therapeutic sounds a lot better than insane, so I'll take it. Yeah, right there. Okay. So that part's done. So you got a little side area there. Let's just go ahead and stick another. Yeah. Yeah, I can't put a corner on there because. True plot, what's up, baby? Welcome to the stream. Do a little experimentation, a little bit of theorizing, and a little bit of that uh, that lovely crap that y'all seem to enjoy so very much. Okay, so there's that. Back of it's looking a little shysty, but that's okay. That's okay. And then, um, okay, so now this side's all staggered and looking like weirdnesses. We can leave that. <laughs> Yeah, well, okay, fine. Lunatic. Well, we, we can use a different term if you like. Whatever whatever floats your boat, sir. Whatever floats your boat. Okay, uh... What'd you miss? Uh, I don't know, John. A lot, of, a lot of talking about how to steal things from other people and how to recognize um, build styles and why it's valuable to try and duplicate other people's shit. For the most part, we did that before the break, and then I took a break, and then now we're back here, where I'm going to try and make this something more final. Yeah. Kilka, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Oh, and uh, Zio, if you're lurking, how you doing, man? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Zio's a, apparently a longtime uh, viewer who does not like to uh, hang out and chat, which is fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But I just remembered he messaged me on Reddit the other day asking about my settings, and I'm like, so I wanted to give a shout out. What's up, Zio? If you're watching this, how you doing, man? How's it going, babe? Um, you know, no. This is the right idea, but the wrong application. What I want to do is uh, floor. And then we'll do uh, the wall. Where's the wall? Where's the window wall? There it is. Yeah, see, that's how we'll do it. That way I can get symmetrical while being asymmetrical. No. We use the other prefab now. Yeah. Um, no. I want this way. Yeah, that looks kind of funky. That's a little funky. Um... So 
So yeah, the counter goes here though. If the counter's gonna go here, and then back out there. Okay, now this doesn't work. This doesn't work. Um, find sat down and made myself actually upload your video. Well, awesome, John. Do you uh, can you share with the class? <laughs> uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and stick a railing in there. And then that there. And then, uh... okay, I gotta drop the, I drop the, I, blah, 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 I gotta drop the counter so I can see what the hell's going on here. Um, oh no, you don't. No, you do not. No, you do not. Oh well, it's good. We can just sleep. That's fine. We we'll go 13. Sure. Put the ad up. Yay, hooray. <laughs> That's all right. You know, if you know, if you don't have a link handy, John, no big deal. But if you do, man, drop that bad boy in the chat. Sharing is caring. That way we can all steal your shit. Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. Oh boy, it's raining again. Okay. Doo, 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 doo. I make this the storage room of sorts. We can just put stuff in the back in the closet there. Just put a vending machine in there or something. I don't know. Make that the bathroom. <laughs> uh. Okay, store. Oh, all right. Perfect. Thank you, Jack. Thank you, thank you. So we're going to make this the bar. Food and drink. All right. So we're going to use this one. So if I do this and I put it back like this, yeah? Put the bartender back in the corner like this. No one puts baby in the corner. Is there enough room to walk over here? Yeah? Kinda? Kinda? Uh... Well, you know what? I just put a wall up here. That's what we'll do. We'll just stick a. Uh, we'll snap a. We'll snap a wall and make this a separate patio side. Yeah. Yeah, you're going in there. I don't give a shit. The nice thing about work is it's got this nice flat spot right here that I can use for group slicing as long as I don't. As long as I remember not to put anything else. near it. Oh, also, um, a little, uh, a little note on those who build vanilla no DLC, or for those who build vanilla, whatever. Uh, the ashtray has a nice little property when you group select it as a combo. Uh, I'm going to try and describe this as best I can from memory for you all, so you can see the application that I had it for. So I was going to fix the, uh, I was going to put a doorway, a metal doorway, in the kitchen, in the yellow house at the sanctuary, okay? The house of the workshop, you go in the house, take a left, and there's the kitchen in there, right? The original kitchen stuff. I wanted to put a metal doorway in there, right? So I grabbed, uh, I grabbed my little ladder, the little wood ladder, and I group selected it. And I tried to slide it in there because I wanted to. I wanted to adjust the height up and down, right? I wanted just the height up and down. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I wanted to adjust the height sideways. What? No, the height's up and down, dipshit. So anywho, I um. I wanted to adjust the height of it, so I used the wood ladder to put it in place, but it would not go. It just would not go. It turned red every time I touched it. Would not cooperate at all. So then I got the ashtray out, 
and I used the Asherah group select it, and it slid right in there. But it was too tall. I didn't want the lintel showing. So what it did is I group selected the ashtray and the door frame with the ladder. And it worked. So, so yeah. Basically it was like this. Let me show you. Let me show you the process I went through, right? So I had the metal I had the metal door frame. Yeah. I had the metal door frame like this, right? I'm like, okay, cool. Cool. I'll just take this, yeah, and I'll just take my little ladder. Yeah, like this. And I'll just group select it and I'll stick it in, I'll just stick it right in the door frame, right? Could not could not do it. You know what? Okay, so we're gonna do a little intermission here, folks. Um, we're gonna do a little bit more tangential work here because I just remember she hasn't built sanctuary. So maybe I can duplicate it and show you what I'm talking about. There should be music on these on these screens. They should keep the fog. They probably do, right? I got the music turned off. Okay. So you got this, yeah? And you have... Oh, Jesus. Okay, I got some stuff in the way here. Need to move some stuff. Oops. Um, that was interesting. Okay. So the thing that I solved here... Here's, here's some more problem-solving stuff that you guys might appreciate. I don't know. Is there anything in this desk? No. What am I even doing in here? I just I just left the stuff here, huh? Actually, you know what? I can leave that there. Let's move this. Move this. Oh, it's all it's all on the big rug. Okay, how is that even connected to the desk? Uh what? Actually, you know what? Let's be smart. Let's just not let's be smart. Let's just quick save really fast. And, I don't know why the candle's attached to that desk, but I'll take it. So that way I can move all this shit and then just reload to show you the problem. So the people who build with no DLC vanilla can appreciate this. Okay, so I was trying to fix this doorway. Yeah? And I wanted to... Let's just take this out of there so I can get out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to load after this anyway, so just don't save. Yeah? Actually, you know what? Hang on a sec. Let me do a hard save just in case it auto saves. Yeah. Okay. So then let's just save. Make a new save. Come on. What are all these old saves? Look at all this shit. Um, wow. That's an old save. That was still when I was working on County Crossing. So was that. Look at that. Okay, let's just save over this one. Okay. Ronan, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Scott, how's it going? Welcome to the stream if I'm not welcome to you. Okay, so I hard saved here. So let's go ahead and just destroy this shit because I don't even care. Now it hops back up there. Sure. Okay. Okay. So, what I wanted to do originally was I wanted to put a metal doorway in in the uh, in the kitchen. And I thought what I could do is I could just get the, the ladder out because this is what I use in No DLC Vanilla to sink things. To get it to go in there right so if this works like no dlc this will not work it will not allow me to sink this through the way i wanted it to but of course now it fucking does okay whatever so okay definitely dlc changed the functionality of this wall because i had the worst time getting this thing in here yeah but yeah here it just works fine you guys can kiss my whole ass this is some bullshit anyway so let's pretend it didn't work, yeah? <laughs> so what I did, what I had to do is I went ahead and I got, because uh, I noticed that if I put, if I built an ashtray here, right? I used the ashtray, 
the ashtray would just slide right in. Yeah? It would just go right in here like this. The ashtray just, it doesn't even turn red at all, ever. It's like, whatever, I don't care. Right? Because the softening properties of the ashtray. So what I ended up doing was I did this. I group selected the ashtray. I group selected the ashtray with the door frame. And it softened the door frame up enough and it allowed me to uh, go up and down. So if you are having difficulty group selecting things through existing structures in vanilla no DLC, this is one potential way to get around it is include the ashtray in the group selecting chain and it'll it'll soften the frame up enough to where you can sink it through the floor and get it into place so that's it that's what i wanted to show you <laughs> so now let's go back to warwick <laughs> gail how you doing welcome to stream bonjour how you doing okay so yeah we have a lot of theorizing and shit today and oh my thing is going yellow and red this is not good uh I hope the stream is holding up. Hope y'all are not buffering too much and hope it's not getting all wonky on you. Oh, Warwick is down here. Dun 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 So what do you got? Gas mask, leather armor, leather arm, metal arm. Okay. So here we are with this thing in progress. really great idea you're welcome nikita i'd say it, it's 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 a potential it's just another tool to use just in case you get stuck like if there's you know like you have okay now it won't go because that thing's because that thing is that thing is ashtrayed in there i do like the idea of a side patio though so but now this won't snap back in because that that thing is in a weird spot so we're going to take that out and I want to put a railing on the outside of this. So let's put a railing on the outside of that. But yeah, you can get, when you come here, you can count on random, random crap happening. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. But every now and then I, I remember something that I wanted to share with y'all. So it's like, that's why I kind of hate not, I kind of hate building when I'm not streaming because it's like I think of things and I'm like, fuck, I wish I could have shown you guys that. And I can't record on the PC because the PC is not powerful enough to record and play at the same time, unfortunately. I mean, technically, I guess all I could do is just stream it unlisted and then pull it back down and uh, edit it that way. It's something to think about, I suppose. Uh, yeah. Oh, and... um. Actually, never mind. I'll do that. I'll cover that later. I'll cover that later. Okay. Let's get this back in here. Let's get this back in here. Okay. Okay. There's our lat there. Oh, oh, looking good. But see, that's why even now I still reach for the ashtray. Because the ashtray sits flat, does wonderful, wonderful things with the undersides, and... Um, I don't like that big gap under there. So now comes the fun part. Now we do some serious work on the bottom here because I need to lift this thing way the hell up. Come on. Way up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Can't remember what it's major G4 XP build. Uh, if you look at. You can leave a comment on this challenge video or you can hit him up in Discord, John. Um, he's got a Discord channel. Uh, if you go to my my entry, I linked his channel and the challenge video, so you can get you can get the data from there as well. In addition, superfluously, um, sure. Actually, I want this one. I want to see if this one will fit in there. Yeah. Let's see if that one will fit in there. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, let's do a little surgery on the bottom here. Okay, so right there, and over here, ease it in. Okay, it's not quite straight. Come on. Come on, there you are. And then down, and then up. And there. Hey, Cricket. 
See? The NPC sit spot's right there. Now she's in my way. Yeah, right there. Good enough. Okay. Now we drop this thing back down. Cricket. Okay. Well, it doesn't like to go all the way down. That's fine. See, now behind the stairs, you've got a little bit of 3D. Wants a piece of what I got. <laughs> yeah, baby. Oh my god. You crazy, crazy, crazy. Share your stuff channel. Yeah, you could do that. You could do that. I, I sent him a I sent him a DM myself. But that's because I had to beg him to use his logo because I needed a bigger logo for the thumbnail. Okay, so there's that. Yeah. So now we've got you go inside, you get your snackins, and you can go this way. Or you can go this way. Right. And then Bish Bash Bosh, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Let's put the bar here. Leaves a lot of room for them to walk here, which is good. And then we got this room down. I got so many flavors of mayhem for sale. I <laughs> see so you're not bothered by floors. <laughs> She's still give a fuck, does she? Uh, where's the kitchen? It's gonna be out back here. I'm, I'm, I am gonna duplicate his outdoor kitchen idea as well. Once I get done with this, because I did like that. I'll probably end up fencing it off on the back of the chain link fence here, and I may take this this busted gate down, this busted fence down, because I don't like it, and I can just um, replace it with junk walls or whatever. But that's that's um that's future plans i'm trying to figure out what this monstrosity of a building because this thing's already getting out of hand and i'm like oh i need to add more shit to it um but huh okay so now we're at the point where i need to start really thinking about where i'm going to put this thing in it for its final in its final position Roger Rabbit, how's it going? Welcome to the stream, sir. How are you doing today? Okay, so now we need to go think about where this thing's going to go. And it's going to go up against the back wall. Yeah, it's going to go up against the back wall. Oh, i got to fix that fence, right? Because if I don't... If I don't... I'm not going to be able to place it because of the build border. But if I do fix it, I won't be able to group select it. Well, shit. What's how? What are we gonna do? I gotta replace the fence first. I actually have to get rid of this first. But if I put junk fences in here, it's gonna it's gonna give me too many uh, firm collision things. That's gonna be a pain in my ass. But I gotta get rid of it. I gotta get rid of it. And I'm gonna replace it with. Um, Man, I wish I had chain link fences. Quick, go so much to my mod. We're vanilla ogre. Come on now, you know, you know how we're doing it here. Yeah, let's just do a raggedy ass wall here with a couple adjustable wrench room. Did I just lose my provisioner line? <laughs> how did I know? Right? How did I know? I'm like, wait a minute. I'm using up. I'm using up materials. Okay, so now we got to wait for. Uh, my provisioner to not be dead. Ammo, weapons, and messy death. I got it all. What's he getting killed by? These bugs up here? They usually run into trouble over here by the Poseidon. No, those guys are calm. Is he getting killed by raiders down here? Actually, where's that blood bug? Here? Yeah, no. Sit down. Come on. 
God, these guys are so bitch deep. You little shit, look at that dodge, man. That's some fucking straight Skyrim arrow dodge and shit right there. You punk ass. Let's get rid of you. Anybody else down here? Oh, a frag mine? Well, I didn't know that was down here. Okay, it's mine now. Mine. It's mine. Ha <laughs> Bailed help defend Somerville Place. Whatever, I don't care. Anybody else out here? Why is my provision room getting hung up? Is he getting hung up by these raiders? What are you doing down here, dude? Yeah? Getting salty? Yeah, fall under the... Fall under the, uh, under the world there? Yeah, nothing but a stain. Nothing but a stain. Oh, they're just gonna get shot. Well, it's it's not so much that JPEG. It's the fact that the physics of it are completely completely ridiculous. Uh, the same. It's the same problem that the uh, the Skyrim uh, the Skyrim archery does, where they just do this immediate 60 mile an hour slip slide to the left or right. It's like, dude, really? Could you have made it a little less obvious, please? Thanks. <laughs> it's just like the fuck is that? I mean, dodging when the arrow's been launched is one thing, but dodging when it's almost there and then it's goes, Joo! I'm just like, nah. The fat man. Using a fat man against a bloat fly seems a little bit excessive. Dalton, I'm just going to put that out there. Okay, let's see if I got my uh, provisioner back by now. Jamaica Plain. Oh, the provisioners come, my provisioners here come from uh, 81. 88. Let's go see where he is. I can't build without resources, and I don't have any resources, so. <sighs> Yay, chain link fence pieces. Yay, chain link fence pieces. Okay. Do we have it now? No. Okay, so this is... We might have to... Uh... <laughs> Nothing is excessive. <laughs> I should just get... I should install aim anywhere, right? Give me a snap aim mod that just, that just goes to... So my provisioner is down somewhere. Um, and this is a problem. This is a problem. <sighs> Reclear Quincy? Mm, maybe? Oh, he's back now. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay. Six. All right. Well, he's back, so... Isn't that an achievement in this game? Uh, no, uh, there's an achievement for getting killed by a by a by a by a mini nuke, which I got very early on in my first playthrough in Lexington. It's called touchdown. <laughs> you carry the foot. You got the football right in the face. It's like, yep. Come on. Okay. All right. So let's see if we can't get this wall in there. Yeah, yeah, prisoners do that in Manila, dude. I've got one on. Th I think I've got one on her. Yeah, see? Spans the gap just fine. And up. Yeah, okay, so it does span the gap. Okay. So now we need to eyeball it from back here. By using the uh, about there, now it needs to be a little bit forward. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm. Cricket, Jesus Christ, girl, personal space. Personal space. Yeah, and this one here, I've got, uh, I've got this crazy line going right across the middle of everything. I don't know what the fuck is going on with that. I don't even know where that line came from. But yeah, it's just, uh, it just works. It just works, guys. It just works. It just works. Six thirty-four. Let's go for thirteen and put the ad up. La di da di di da. Does the supply chain break? Yeah, when the provisioner, when the provisioner is injured enough to go to a knee to take a knee, they fall on their butt. It breaks the line because it takes them out of it takes them out of active. 
it takes a amount of active uh, I don't know it, they just become inactive far stepper what's up welcome to the stream okay well here's the cow so clearly the prisoner is back let's make sure let's double check yep he's still here good okay so that's where this thing is gonna go um, we need to shore this up with something Let's go ahead and grab. Uh, let's go ahead and grab uh, some wire fencing because that's what I do. Since I don't have chain link to fix it with, which is tragic. Let's see if this will work. Yeah, maybe it will. 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 Are they going to walk out the hole? No, they're going to walk out the front gate. Okay, good. And we are definitely going to need some... Uh, we are definitely going to need some uh, quick saving in here. For show. It doesn't look too bad. So, there's, so there you go. There's your answer. That's how wide a wire fence is. It is one and a half walls high. We're almost one and a half walls wide. Turbo Teller, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Okay, and then this. Um, I'm going to put more underneath it. Will these fit? Yeah, I could probably just stick that in there. Let's just do that. While this thing chugs away because it's raining. Okay, let's get that in there. Look at that. Look at that. Like it's like butter. God, I love these fences. I mean, I hate the width of them, man, but they just, they play so nice with everything. Go down a little bit so it doesn't overlap. Oh, okay, that's good. Okay. So now we patched the hole in the wall there. Wig boy, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, that looks, that looks reasonable. I mean, it's not overlapping too badly. And it's got little supports in it. And from the front, it looks like shit, which is pretty much what I'm after. So, booyah. Just got this post kind of sticking down in the middle. It's like, yep. Yep. Stella, what's up? Welcome to the stream. Got to head off. All right, Kate. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you had a good time today. And uh, be sure to check out everybody's channels here, man. We got a lot of builders here on this stream. A lot of builders on this stream. You have plenty of material to, uh, to crib from. And... Da, 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 da. So now I've got this, which means this is going to have to go against the fence. Oh, I'm going to need a really weird ladder angle on this one, man, to put this in place because I can't see the back corner of it. I won't be able to see the back corner, and I do want to make sure it's lined up on the fence line here. So. Let's see what we can do here, yeah? All right, so here comes, here comes the major movement portion. Mm, I'm gonna have to move this right now, aren't I? Okay. Let's fill in the bottom here while I've got this here. Because I'm not gonna be able to touch it once it goes back in there, because that, I'm not gonna be able to touch it once that, because that other wall. So, let's do this. Get this in here. Ooh, my size bar's getting damn full, isn't it? Not very happy with that. Um, What the hell, guy? How big is the grab radius on those campfires? Okay, it's not that big. Good. Alright. Alright. I just, I thought I just shot the thing to get the daylight out. I guess it, uh, just fucking hates me. Okay, so we're gonna do that. Right. We just like to ask how many don't there's not like place anywhere in place in red. Because I enjoy the challenge, big boy. I like figuring out how things work. And I like having videos where anybody who watches this on any system, any console, any method any, any can can do this. Anybody who's watching this can do this, what I'm doing right now. So, um, but mostly I enjoy the challenge. I mean, I cuss about it a lot. I bitch about it a lot. 
but I'd like to see what I can get away with, with just knowing how the pieces work, knowing how the tools I have in vanilla work, and um, that kind of stuff. This, the, the secondary answer, the follow-up answer, the thorough answer, is that by having too many options, my head would explode. I, I think it would take me forever to make a build if I had Place Anywhere. Because, I mean, honestly, if I'm going to use Place Anywhere, dude, I'm just going to play, I'm going to build in the PC and do it in the creation kit. I mean, it's the same thing, you know? Different interface. But, I mean, if I'm going to if I'm gonna go to that level of detail, I might as well just build in the friggin' CK, yeah? So, that's why. It's a, it's a choice. It's not a, uh, it's not a... It's, it's something that I get yelled at for a lot. <laughs> not naming names, Dalton. So, yeah, you're not the first person to ask, believe me. But it's just, I just I just prefer this. It's more fun to me this way. Because that way, when I get something to place where it shouldn't be placed in vanilla, I, dude, the sense of accomplishment, I'm like, yeah, fuck yeah, dude. I got that thing to go where it shouldn't have gone. Hell to the yes. Okay, so we're going to do, um... Let's just make this a patio, yeah? Sure. Alright, so we got a nice open patio on the right, and we're going to enclose this on the left after... That's really good, no other YouTubers do stuff like that. It's just, I mean, I just want my stuff... When I started the channel, Big Boy, I started it with the Methods and Techniques series to basically show people here, you don't think you can build, but you totally can, and this is why, and here's how, you know? And that motif just kind of carried over. I just like knowing that my stuff is accessible to everybody, you know? Literally anyone who has this game, any mod set, any console, any platform, can do exactly what I'm doing right now. Now with mods, of course, you can you have different ways to do it, different tools, and you have different abilities, but in the main, okay. Now how much do I want to build this out? It's, is this gonna touch the fence? It's gonna touch the fence, right? Yeah, I kind of do need to do that, don't I? I need to build that, uh, it's about the journey. Yes, that is a great way to sum it up, yeah? Because uh, I enjoy the process more than I do the actual finished product. In fact, uh, wait, most of the builds you see on my streams, most of the builds you see on my channel don't exist anymore. They're gone. I, j I tear them down when I'm done. I'm just like, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I just want to build. I don't really care about the finished product. So I do the finished product, and I decorate it, and I take it, do a tour, and then I just tear the fucker down. <laughs> I'm just like, I don't care. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's just do... Let's just do... And this is not going to snap here, right? Because that stairway. Do not store that. And this will not snap back because of this, right? Yeah, okay, that does snap back in, right? Okay, so this one here won't snap back in because I have to take the whole thing apart. Because I want to get a wall in here, you know? I want to get another wall in here. Because I just want to put the, uh, I just want to do his little thing with the, with the thing. Yeah. No. Is that the same height, though? It is, right? Yeah, those walls are the same height. So if I put that little that little couple of roof on here, he used a different roof than this, but I'm going to use the couple of roof because I know it snaps and it's easy to go up there and it's cute. Yeah. It is the same height. Look at that. Huh. I wonder if that wall will snap now. But yeah, so, uh, wig boy. Like, you just hear me talking. I wonder if that'll snap now. I wonder if this will work now. What will happen if I do X, Y, and Z? That's the type of shit that I like to do. That's my favorite part of building. Because, I mean, sometimes it does stupid shit. Like, you know, this. And you're looking at this going, well, what the fuck? But if you wanted a display case, well, now you know you can make a display case, right? Because if you go inside, it's a little display case. How cute is that, yeah? Yeah. So, this is the type of shit that was why I don't use mods, because I discovered things like this. And everybody watching sees this, and it may give them an idea for their build. They're like, oh my god, I could totally make a display case with mannequins behind it now. That is so cute. Oh my god. And you totally could. Yeah? But it was a complete fucking accident, because I didn't know what the hell I was doing. Yeah? It just went in and snapped. I'm like, alright, well, cool. So, uh... But I need... The best tip is to steal. Yes. 
what he said. The best tip actually is to duplicate other people's stuff and then take it apart and do it your way. Okay, in order to get that wall in, I gotta take these stairs out. I gotta take these stairs out. Now I have to see, now I have to take the whole thing apart. Do I wanna do that or could I? Sorry, excuse me, I had to sneeze. Wow, that was, um. So now the question is, how much trouble do I want to go through? Do I want to try and just eyeball it? Yeah, I could probably just eyeball it. I could probably get this thing to work. That's the fun part, big boy. It's like, can I get this to work? I don't know. Let's find out. Not just on YouTube, but I'm ready. Yes. What bitch bash? Yeah, steal from wherever you can, man. I mean, you know, give credit. If, you know, if people say, oh my god, your stuff is awesome, go thanks, but I totally stole this from, you know, whatever. Like this thing I'm building here, I basically stole the framework from Clinton. And I linked his video in the description. Credit where it's due, man. So it's not really theft, it's just more like uh, aggressive, aggressive appropriation, <laughs> I guess. But like it gives me ideas for things that I would not have had otherwise. And that is part of the fun. Okay, so that'll go through there. I can kind of get it to there. Is that going to be good enough? Let's go up. And... Okay, so I cannot get it... Ah! <gasps> there it is! It's not as far in as it should be, but damn it if it don't look good enough. Yeah? Good enough, baby! Good enough. It's aggressive borrowing. <laughs> there you go. Exactly. Do I know it's a fire? Yeah, Nick, I'm going to move it over here. That's why I had to build this wall first. Basically, this thing is going to be the back wall going along this row right here. But I'm trying to finish up this part of the build here because I know once I get it in place, this corner right here is going to be up against this fence right here. And I won't be able to touch it. So i got to get that in place right now. Um... Yeah, I, now I see what you mean, Clint. I see what you mean, Clint. Change plan. It's not working like I wanted it to. So, I can do this and this. Move you out of the way, please, and thank you. And this. And then we do some glass, which is here. And the nice thing is I can bury it with the broken ones. And here. And we'll put this thing on top. Yeah, that's what I want. I want it a little bit lower. Okay, quick send. No one's, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Steal it, change it, post it, and they'll let us steal it back. That's exactly how we all learn, man. That is the currency of this channel. That's how we all get better as builders. That's how we all figure out new things to do with our various styles. That is where the money is. That's where the fun is. Because doing the same shit over and over at any fun. But if you get an idea from somebody and you're like, holy fuck, that's awesome. I'm totally stealing that. My God, that's great. And in the process, in the process of stealing it, you get some more ideas. You're like, oh, this is awesome. And then they'll come to your channel and share other things with you that might be worthwhile and interesting and fun and what have you. Okay, this thing is probably going to be a bitch and a half to get to go. But, let's see if we can anyway. See, the thing is I got too many adjacent surfaces here, I think. So, this might not work. Da, 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 da. Kiwi, what's up, baby? Welcome to the stream. Aha! See, in there, I just discovered that the placement of the marble tracks matters. Okay. So we are not going to get much love here, I don't think. No? Because I need to sink this thing just a little bit below. 
Yeah, I'm not getting any purchase here. Just right there. Is it because I need to put it on this other side, maybe? Maybe it's hitting on something underneath? Now see, the thing is, there is probably a very easy, straightforward way to get this to go. Because I, but, but because I don't think like Clint does, Clinton does, it doesn't occur to me that... It doesn't occur to me that that's an option. So this is where it gets tricky, right? This is why it's so valuable to, to steal other people's shit. Because it, it teaches you a different way of thinking. Fire time. <laughs> yeah, I, I get this, Shaq. I, I figured I got it. I got it. We're, we're, we're doing it. I just looked over at chat and I'm like, oh, yeah, no shit. That's here we go. I don't know, though. We got a lot, a lot, a lot of surfaces here, Shaq. Yeah, we got a lot of surfaces here. And it doesn't like those stairs at all. It doesn't like them stairs at all. At all. So, the stairs are what's going to be changing. Because that is the piece that's holding me up. I'm doing all this shit to try and get this one thing to work. And I'm like, you know what? I'll just move the stairs and fire them in back in later. Yeah. MLG, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Um. Da -da -da. And of course, the Winterbeer says it's the stairs. I should read chat before I try doing this stuff, guys. I really should think about doing that more often. Yeah. So the stairs are gone. And. Man, it didn't like this at all. It does not like this. As soon as it touches the floor, man, it just, it just goes red. Um. Hmm. It could be hitting that. Well, let's see. It, will it even snap to this? Yeah, see, it snaps to that. But it snaps inside. Hmm. It snaps there, but I don't want it there. That's the problem. I want it lower. Let me think here. Let me think here. How am I going to... Sometimes, guys, I am not the sharpest knife in the drawer. Okay? Let's just... Let's just put it out there. Let's just... Let's just be honest with us. Let's just be honest with it. Okay? Let's just be honest with it. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to go ahead and guess that it's that fire that's giving me the problem. Okay. Now that we're clear of that fire, let's see if it goes. Probably should quick save some point. Can you pillar one bit and snap the rest? No, I... Tr I the... The snapping, the not snapping is why, I'm, why I have to pillar it in the first place. The not snapping is why I'm having to pillar it. But, it's like right there, and it should totally work, but it doesn't. Something about this compound structure does not work. But let's try, let's just go ahead and do, see it snaps there, and it snaps here. Could the roof be hitting the other roof? Well, it's not... Well, maybe. I mean, we could try that. I don't think that's the problem, though. Because the thing is, if you look, right, when these pieces snap to the floor, they snap inside, not outside like they do in the warehouse pieces. So it's got two snapping surfaces, two magnet surfaces, on the inside of the floor piece. But we're going to try it just to make sure. Because this could just be the easiest solution. Yeah? And if it is... Booyah. Let's try. Nah, see, it's the floor. It's absolutely the floor doing it. Because it snaps here. Yeah? 
it snaps inside the piece. So as soon as it clears the piece, it's fine, but as soon as I take it down, it doesn't go. So, what does that mean? It means the roof can go back on. So it's definitely the floor causing a problem. The patchwork floor? You mean the, uh... Well, here, let's try that. You mean the one with the multi-layered one with all the plywood on it that the rugs sink through? This thing here, right? You're talking about this one? I can try it. Can't hurt. Let's go ahead and snap uh, this bad boy there. Okay, it snaps back. Yeah. Okay, it snaps back. Okay, let's try the patchwork floor. Well, it definitely snaps easier, so that, that's got that's got that going for it. Let's see if the, let's see if anything changes here. Let's see if you need luck with this one. No. Mm. Same thing. It does that same thing. Okay, so that's not going to work. But how about? you because you're already a sinkable surface man it just fucking hates this look at this wow it literally doesn't want to work with anything Jesus this is um hmm Well, we can try sinking a single piece, fire the floor back in after, but it won't have, without a floor, there won't be a surface, it'll just be dirt, right? Yeah, see, even a single piece won't, ah. Okay, so we do a little bit outside. Oh, well, look at this. Okay, let's try this. Hopefully this is not too low. Okay, so there it is. We're going to go about half height. Yeah, about to there. Oh, God, that's not even close to the end. <laughs> Place the wall, roof, the wall roof structure first and place the floor in that's last resort because um, I, I would find it I think I'm gonna find it more difficult to get the floor back in than I would to get this thing on there where I want it so we're gonna go I'm, I'm gonna stick with this for now and uh, we're gonna see if I can't get some snap action going and ease it down till it just turns green which is about there and then up so half height, a little bit lower. There. Okay. Now, are we going to get any snap action here? Yes. Oh my god, it sticks to the floor, so it's not straight. <laughs> it's definitely not straight. Um, but, let's just keep checking the snap here. So if I can get the snap on this bad boy. Yeah. I can get the snap on it, so that's kind of nice. Hmm. 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 <laughs> if I go inside, can I see where it goes? Yeah? Okay, so if it'll snap all the way around, then in theory, it should be placeable all the way around. Oh, and for the, uh, previous inquiry on why don't you place anywhere this right here is why most people would be all oh my god this is such a pain in the ass oh this is terrible blah 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 why are you fucking doing this but for me dude this is the fun part because we're all trying to figure out why this fucking won't work and when it does work dude oh my god the feeling of satisfaction because it will work we'll get it to work i don't know how exactly yet but but Man, it doesn't like to be grouped like this as, as... Okay, so snapping... <sighs> I 
Hmm. I guess I'm just going to have to eyeball it, right? I'm going to have to eyeball it. Hope I get it straight eventually. That's how we're going to have to do it. Yeah. Pillar on the inside? Okay. We can do that. I'll definitely be able to see it better. Oh, you mean with the three? Ah. Ah. That has potential. Da, da, da. You have to go to your bag. We're almost, we're almost done, MLG. I'm, I'm pretty much reaching the end of my thing. I'm just going to get this thing in place, and I'm just going to friggin... I'm going to get this in place and call it. So, yeah, look at that shit. Check for the win, dude. Look at this. Perfect. Okay, that's stupid. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> all this time struggling, and all we had to do was put it in the fucking dirt, dude. Can you believe that shit? Well, I can, because that's how my life usually goes, but... Hey, look at this. Works like a charm. Works like a charm. I mean, it's not... He doesn't walk, go into this thing there, but... Yeah. Okay, I need to see the corner here more. Yeah, so I get, if I can get the corner done... Yeah, look at that shit. Alright. So Shek, once again, shows us how it is supposed to be done. And up to about... Yeah. Yeah, that's that's reasonable height right there. Yeah. Nothing showing. Fucking perfect. Fucking perfect. To quote Stacy Place Fallout, that looks fucking perfect. <laughs> yeah, it does. And the best part is now I can sink this thing back in there really easily because I've already got the uh, I've already got Daniel, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Trying to move the two lower walls and group select. Ruin the two lower walls, groups like the rest snapped off. Oh, I see. Like do the do the framework on top first? That that could have worked as well. That's also uh, a possible solution. But yeah, you just get these bad boys right in. You know what? No, let's snap the walls on first. Let's make sure the walls can snap on before I start getting them all dedicated and shit. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Well, I hope that's tall enough. Um is that tall enough? I'm gonna hit my head on the on the thing, aren't I? <gasps> no, I made it. Of course, it looks goofy now. I don't know. Well, there's a will, there's a way, and I've got the way. Gonna do that. I'm gonna do. Where is it? Warehouse walls, right? It's because I want the triangle. Yeah. Oh, it ain't gonna go, is it? Or will it? Maybe it will. Look at that. It'll snap right through the other thing when it won't snap. Oh! Did it snap? Come on. Oh, will you stop doing... I can't believe it snaps like that, though. Okay, I'm going to put it in there and see what it looks like. Well, or not. No, it looks stupid. Okay. Cool. Okay, it'll snap to that wall, but it won't snap to itself. Um, yeah, it won't it won't snap to this part here. So, um, well, I know it'll snap to another wall. So let's get the wall in there. Let's just put this wall in there. What are you snapping to? Oh, come on! You just did it, right? There. Okay. So now the thing will snap to the top of that. Yeah. It should. I'll turn one of those, huh? Come on. I saw you turn green, but it was like when I was holding A. There it is. And then this piece here. Now I can't get in. <sighs> I can't get in because of the stairway. Okay. And then what I'll do is I'll just use the other roof. 
Am I on PC? No, I'm on Xbox. Xbox One, currently. I do play on PC, but... Yeah, there we go. Yeah, that looks kind of cozy. Nice thing there's no holes in the roof there for this one, but whatever. Yeah, that'll work. It's not perfect, it's not exact, but I mean, it's not supposed to be, right? If I were on PC, what would I, what would you recommend? Because there are people who do play on PC, and if there's a PC solution to this, I mean, other than just, you know, console commanding the shit out of it, which is modding, <laughs> but, but, uh, yeah. There you are. See, look at the stairs. Look at going there. Look at how pretty that is. That's so pretty. Okay. And voila. So, I guess we're going to be moving this thing next week because I am crapped out. That ain't modding. Can you do it on a stock PS4? Then it's modding. Console commands when you're building is modding. It makes it not vanilla. Uh, yeah. That's decent, I guess. Okay. So, let's go ahead and run through what we built today, uh, such as it is, I guess. Let me move all my tools out of the way, so when I take the picture of the screenshot later on, it won't be uh, all cluttered with my with my tool set here. And uh, put the fires down there. Put the fires down there. Okay, so what we got today... What we got today is we built... Uh, well, we got the wiring going, right? We got the wiring going into the house up there. We've got ourselves a little storage module under here where the barrels were. I just basically chunked in this uh chunked in this prefab stuck some crap on it to make a little hut yeah then we built this ladder up to the top where we put some power and and we fall off because that's what we do and then we have a guard shack number three which is this backwards ass monstrosity which is basically a guard station stuck through a door frame and got some wings here with some uh, wire for the the turret stands got a roof so he's all done there yeah and it looks like this from the bottom since I got some lights hanging up underneath there yeah so that's a pretty formidable looking little outpost the underlighting really makes it look ominous and then we uh, then for the rest of the stream we basically tried to duplicate and riff off of Clinton Siemens uh, roadside eatery which uh links in the description go check it out it's really cool uh, as i see more things that i'm stealing from i will post those links as well but the framework is basically here it's definitely different than his application because he did things uh, slightly differently um let me see chairs let me see what the boost look like shit i didn't even check that i probably should have checked that at some point but I did not because, you know, whatever. Oh, yeah, they'll, they'll fit in there pretty good. I'll probably have to group select them in to get them to go. But, yeah. Oh, that's what he did. He used the, he didn't use these walls on the outside. Ah, okay. Anyway. Um, but, yeah. So, you've got the entrance here. You've got the, the bar here. I'm going to duplicate the, uh, the backyard fire pit thing on this side when I move it back in there. And then uh, I'm going to bolt this onto the outside for more seating. And then, I don't know, maybe just leave that ramp like it is. Just leave that as a secondary entrance. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. It works. Vanilla No DLC on Tuesday? If I stream on Tuesday, it will be Vanilla No DLC. Yes. Absolutely. It'll be the FNG for sure. Because I got to show Sheck the, uh, I got to show Sheck the, the three by three that I did. Because I, uh. The one I did for G4XP's challenge was not quite to spec, so I was farting around with him the other day, and I was like, you know what, I'm going to see what I can do sticking exactly to the 3x3 boundaries, yeah? And it came, uh, 
it came out a little funky. Um, it definitely was different than anything I've done before. So uh, we'll do this here, yeah? Do that there. So we'll do the sign off. I want to thank y'all for stopping by, sharing your Sunday with me for the up to three hours and change that we did because we got we got the bit in our teeth we kept running. If you had a good time today, I'd appreciate you to click that like button down there. Let uh, let uh, YouTube know that this stuff is actually popular and might be worth watching for other people. <laughs> and if you're new to the channel and this is the first thing you are seeing and you like this kind of thing, click subscribe. There will be more of this kind of thing. I stream Fallout 4 Vanilla Building on Sunday starting at noon central, which is this stream. And then I do streaming uh, either Tuesday or Friday and or Friday during the week if I'm not exhausted from work. I'm also still, you guys, I'm still working on getting polished, finished tours up. So as I get those done, you will see those popping up. The next one is going to be Murkwater. I, uh, I'm almost done. I'm pretty much got it done. So if you see a tour come up, it's going to be the Murkwater one that we built on the stream. I want to thank y'all for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care, y'all.